potatoes, stuff, and things. What up, Aaron? How are you? And yeah, I figured just my regular EDM or DJ Pikachu's regular EDM playlist would work because it would sound like shit that you would hear at the nightclubs at the Citadel. I figured it made sense. Hello? Okay. I'm going to have to start, like, on days when I play Mass Effect, because it does that, it switches from the Legendary Trilogy launcher to the actual game and flashes my desktop for a second in between. I'm going to have to, like, come up with, like, weird-ass wallpapers to put there on days I play Mass Effect just to see if anybody catches it. There's like little like Easter egg wallpapers, like blink and you'll miss it. And see if anybody reacts in chat. <laughs> Get like a fucking just really de like like a hey gal face. I'm like fucking. Oh. You were here when I came up with it. Um. Now, this game is quieter. I have to bring the volume up. For me and for you. Uh, Ward's locations. Boy, we want to go to CSEC. Okay. What else you bring up? Okay. To be like, are you really gonna go for that low hanging fruit? With all this exploration of Prothean culture, this must be like a survey for you, Liara. Our travels now are somewhat different from my normal excavations. I would prefer lengthier studies and fewer explosions. I'll give you fewer explosions. Yes, Wait. most of the technology I had hoped to bring back to the flotilla has subsequently attempted to kill us. Low hanging fruit out of this. Oh, I love that we got fucking heavy armor for our boy. Give her a lengthier study. I'll give her plenty of explosions. Kino, put your gun away. Kino, put your gun away. Kino, put your gun away. I was... Hey, yo. I hit a, I hit L3 to sheath my weapon because that's the button in FF14. And all it did in this game was make me crouch. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination oh, I can do squats. So that's something this Kino and that Kino have in common. When they're waiting for things, they can just stand there and do squats. Logged. The commanding officer is aboard. Exo Presley stands relieved. All right. Now. Hades Gamma Cluster to find the hostage. Well, yeah, I plan to. Um, yeah, these are those, those, that, that. That's... Wait, where's the other... I thought we had two in the Hades Gamma Cluster. Or did we do one last week? We did one last week. That was the one with the, uh... With the hidden zombies. That was the one we did at the end of stream last week. That was the one with the, with the, with the hidden cache of zombies. Randomly do squats to you. H to holster your weapon. I mean, it's it's select or back for me. So we have to go back to the Hades Gamma Cluster to get that uh, to get the hostage to save the hostage. It's on a n different planet. Select. Yeah, I mean, on on the Xbox controller, it's referred to as back. But it's select. 
Hey, some people aren't old enough to know that. Some people aren't old enough to know that it's the select button. I gotta be clear. Wasn't it a good... No, you're fine, Link. Don't even worry about it. We just made a fresh batch of iced tea, and it is warm today. So that iced tea is fucking hitting the spot. Mm -hmm. Me too, I appreciate you. I'm glad you're here. Okay, let's go, um, that's Hades Gamma. And we've been to Hawking Eda too. So let's go to Artemis, Ta Artemis Tau. Cause we gotta double back and check all of these places. I've got to log them in my, uh, my, my new and improved. Just came in over oh, here now. it is. This is Admiral the Overlord. I found out who sent that truck to my head. The ones killed by the Thresher War. And I hope you get this message. It was a group called Cerberus. An Alliance Black Ops organization. Top secret, class level security clearance. They vanished a few months ago. Dropped right off the grid. Nobody knew where they went or what they were up to. They've gone completely rogue, Shepard. They're conducting illegal genetic experiments trying to create some kind of super soldier. I don't have any proof, but I found the coordinates for one of their research worlds. I'm uploading them with this message. They're completely out of control. Somebody needs to stop them. I've done my part. Now it's up to you. This, this is probably the last you'll hear from me. Cerberus is after me now. I need to disappear before they find me. Help. Okay. This was where the Thresher Mall was, right? I'll recognize the names of the planets when I see them. This is pretty much my team, because of the way we, uh... Oh no! Wait, or was this the place with the Thresher Maw? Yeah, this was the place where we fought the first Thresher Maw. I didn't explore it, I just thought that this was all it was. <gasps> I didn't actually explore around here. People, countries, planets. I'll recognize them when I... Yeah, I'll recognize them when I see them. It'll hit me. I need to make... Okay, insert one column left. Because I fucked up. It's cluster. Then system, planet, and landmark. Okay.
So it's Artemis Tau. Uh, this is the Sparta system. Because I'm assuming at least one of these things, the planet is going to wait. The planet is going to hit me. It's like an Avengers Infinity War. When fucking uh, Thanos throws one of the uh, moons at Iron Man. Um... Here we go. Okay. No, no! Mr. Bill! Oh! Well, the debris is right here, but then there's a mineral deposit over there. I probably didn't need to fucking billy goat my way over this mountain. Electronics skill too low. Call me the moon because I'm going down, baby. Three streams in a row. Hell yeah. <laughs> nice. Like it. Okay, now we need to go oh, over. I'll see it on the. Because the, the radar expands out pretty wide when you're in the vehicle. Oh well, yeah, it's Majora's Mask. You're Link. Three days. We're all big nerds around here. I found lithium. And then there's an anomaly. Anomaly, anomaly, anomaly. Oh, that's just the That's just a marker on my on my radar. Okay. That's south. Okay, that's yeah, that's the compass. Okay. I was trying to figure out what that little mark was if it was something sticking just inside of my visible uh area. But no, it's just it's just the south tick of my compass. Nerds Club is here, King. Dead guy.
mummified Solarian. Oh! Uh -oh. Guess what day it is? Guess what day it is? Uh, Julie. Uh, What's guess up, Fred? Guess what day it is? Julie. Uh, Julie. Uh, guess what day it is? Guess what day it is? Guess what day it is? <laughs> Anybody? Anybody? Guess what day it is? Guess what day it is? <laughs> Anybody? Anybody? Mike, 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 Mike. Uh, what day is it, Mike? Uh, woo -hoo! Mike, 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 Mike. Uh, what day is it, Mike? Uh, oh, come on. I know you can hear me. Listen, guess what today is? 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 It's hump day. Hump day! <laughs> it's hump day. Hump day! Woo-hoo! Woo-hoo! Uh-oh. Mike, 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 Mike. What day is it, Mike? It's hump day, baby. It's hump day. Who's humping? It's hump day. All right. So we got a mineral and some uh, artifacts. So and an artifact. So doubling back has already borne fruit. <laughs> I'm a born fruit. Um. I'm just doing a nice, big, like a wide, like perimeter sweep of the map here. Just make sure there's nothing tucked away in the far flung corners. Oh shit! Another mineral deposit. Glad to be home finally. Glad you're home too. Knew something looked weird. Oh yeah, you didn't have your artist badge turned on. Door dashing today was stupid. Oh, that sucks. One place, poor front end girl was driving and orders didn't see the order I was picking up because her seat was off. Oh no, poor thing. I hope she knows it wasn't her fault. She has to be given the information in order to actually be able to do the thing. Okay, we don't want to park on top of it! We got some polonium and a good chunk of money for it. That's uh, in the Yangshi system. Okay, we're gonna go do it.
You know what I think we'll do? Even on your two hours to supper time. Just think about how good it'll be when you have it. There's another mineral deposit over here. Yo! So I think what we'll do... For the other planets, I'm gonna sweep through... And, like, recall the planet names and mark... Well, eh, mm. We'll go straight to the things. I think... That, uh... Running around and doing shit like this... Like, actually, like, doing, like, thorough explorations of the, the planets that we can land on's maps. I think is good, uh, Thursday stream, Thirsty Thursday, uh, tipsy shit. What I'm gonna go do, though, is I'm gonna, I'm gonna run, I'm gonna double back to the planets we could land on, and I'm just gonna go straight to the things... Yeah, and there's that other mineral deposit we already found. Okay, so we're good here. We're good on, uh, Idolis. Um, except for that one debris that we need a higher electronics level for. Um. Was it Sparta? It's Sparta. I don't remember if there was anything in, 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 in Macedon. That system name doesn't seem familiar to me. I recall this, I think. Cause I got I had to get out of my ship because I was attacked by stuff. And um I remember Aaron was like, hey, you'll die if you're out of your ship for too long. That was one. It was that debris right there. I think it's electronics too low. And the stronghold. I think there was, um. Some stuff inside that we couldn't do. So I'm just gonna double check because sh this should be electronics too low. And then we'll go to the stronghold, then we'll boop out. Like, I'm not going to do a big giant sweep of this one. We'll do that. That'll that'll be a good Thursday activity, shit like that. I didn't even bother doing all this when I played it first. Then again, I'm not super completionist. I'm not depending on the game. If I really like the game, I am going to, like, be super fucking completionist about it. Google tab up with maps of the planets and hidden objects. Well, game though, surprising how much they crammed in. They really did. If worse comes to worse, I'll do something like that. Aaron. Indeed, I'll follow. Oh. Shit. Apparently my decryption is high enough now that we were able to do that. Or someone in the parties is. Uh-uh. 
I have no idea what's going on with a Niv. Okay, so I've got two spreadsheets going now because I'm a psycho. I have a spreadsheet for known things that were level locked out of, like that debris on that other planet that our electronics was too low. And I also have a spreadsheet of planets that uh, we can do like uh, drunken thorough sweeps of on Thursdays. Like, once I'm sitting around having my adult beverages on Thursday, like a little backlog of planets for us to actually, like, really comb and look for hidden, uh, hidden goodies. Because this one, I'm just going to double check in here. Because I do recall there were, like, item containers in here that we couldn't open, too. Pronounced super nerd wrong way. Yeah. Talked to the bank today. Only time I talked to him was early this morning when I caught him cranking the thermostat. Jesus Christ! Nerds love their spreadsheets. Also, nerd that loves spreadsheets and power. Yes! I, I use spread. I utilize the hell out of spreadsheets. Um. Yeah, no, definitely don't ask your grandpa about that when your aunt is around. Holy fuck. There's all my anime game husbandos. Fuck it. All of your husbandos. No, put the gun away. You trigger happy fuck. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I like how, like, the camera just, like, goes super shaky when I'm running. I also like how I kind of run like a goober, like... Yeah, so it's, uh... Uh... Artemis, Tau, Mastodon, Shargila... Uh, Landmark is a Stronghold... North... And, uh... Decryption... Goofballs that make me laugh. Oh, that one's decryption skill too low to. God, both of them are. Oh shit! I'm glad that didn't kill me. Or 
Return of the Normandy. Oh, God, that fucking ice cheese, God. my throat with how hard I fucking snorted. What? Me almost getting crunched by the door? Salamis! Remember Salamis? Remember Alf? He's back in pog form. Okay, there was no landable planet in Athens. I think there was a planet in Nosos we needed to come back to for stuff. Uh, give me one second. Sorry about that. Um, I had a phone call. Um, the packages are on the way. They are officially shipped. And between both of them, it wasn't bad at all. Because I know, Aaron, you were worried about that because one of them was international. Hello? Oh, no. Well, the B button wasn't working. This is where we found, uh, that was where we found, uh, Liara. So I guess after the events of that, we can't land there anymore. So there's nothing else in Artemis Tau. else did we go? We went to Argos Row. We're 
first one was a package I sent to New Zealand. They wanted uh, tariff numbers and shit. And I was like, oh shit. Argus Row, and this is the Met Ghost system. Who was the box of chips I sent to a friend? She tasted all dressed chips and had to have more. It cost me like 80. Jesus! That's insane. Okay, we found a couple of extra things here. There's a question mark thing. And it makes me nervous. So I guess we already kind of did a good sweep of this planet because we have... Uh, extra uh, goodies already uh, discovered on the map. I remember this. Understood. Yeah, we found like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we, uh, we actually found something there. We were able to recover it. Now what about the debris, though? Met Ghost? Where's Link? Jesus Christ. Our resident monster fucker? I was referring to the fact that he always says he's a monster fucker. Gave me that one.
Oh yeah, this is where we got jumped by fuckers. Heading out. I'm gonna mark this planet down. Just because there are some nooks and crannies, I don't. I think we just found those two things via happenstance. So I'm gonna mark it down. Oh no 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 no! Day for some white cheddar. Wow. Um, and then the Phoenix system. Did we ever come to the Phoenix system? I'm sure we did. I would have been like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We definitely came in and scoped this place out. Yeah, we came here because we already got what was on whatever was on the asteroid. up there for me? Wait. F frugals? I've never heard of a frugals. It's a burger joint? Never heard of it. Hidden structure. Debris anomaly. We'll go check these and then we'll come back for the hidden structure. No, I f this is where the cult was, isn't it? Also, picked up something. Yeah. Cognarts? What happened? Link want to be sure the good news is no longer a single Pringle. Oh, nice! Mazel tov. Where's Link? Oh, there's Link.
This is definitely one we'll have to do a full sweep because I we only found one like optional thing and it's because it was on our way between two of the marked things. So this is one I'll add to the list to come back tomorrow when we're getting adult beverages and actually do like a, a comb through. But I just want to hit the actual marked ones just in case because some of the other ones we actually had leveled up stuff enough to get them now. Heart rate just 160. Oh, jeez. Hope you can get it down. Mike's doing the think. I'm doing the think. I'm doing my fucking uh, psychotic spreadsheet thing. I'm gonna learn better from last time. take the path of least resistance because I remember what I did last time to get to that. obsessed bat. Wait, what? Well, it was, it was my bad. Because I, yeah, I forgot to save the notepad file because last Friday when I was having trouble with my uh, Bluetooth on this computer. And I was like restarting it over and over again and shit. I forgot to save that notepad file. Hey, we got some matriarch writings. And there's a pyramid. It doesn't look like there's an entrance. So apparently that one we were able to recover now. And I do think in the uh, cult compound, there were things that I was too low level in some respects to interact with. But now all the people are gone. So 
so at least I don't have to hassle with them. Balance hungry, need to calm down. Do that! Get some food and get your and, 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 and unwind a little bit. We'll be right here when you're done. We're too used to Google and all right. I was reminding him to save, they call me saved obsessed bat. I'm 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 oh I'm normally pretty decent about saving. Redeploying. Oh yeah, this was the place where we found that armor. We found that Krogan armor. And there were definitely things we couldn't open because there's still an exclamation point on the map marker. Maybe we can open them now. No, we can't. So that one's decryption. And were there any upstairs? Oh, oh, oh I'm running. I was gonna say it's yelling at me about a medical kit yeah there's that one where the armor was okay so then yeah it's just the one downstairs that we need decryption for so now let's go to Hawking Eda that's where the cult compound was Pretty good, Pantheon. How you doing? Yeah, there's only one system in Hawking Eda. Fucking planet Kamehameha over here. Um, I 
Finally got the router set up. Uh, wi -Fi. Nice! Congrats. That's always nice when you actually have, like, the internet all set up and ready to go. I am, I'm going to put this um, on the list because we're just going straight for the biotic compound. So I'm putting that on the, on the full sweep list, but we're going straight for the compound. Uh, I'm gonna get to relax some this weekend. I hope it's been exhausting. Hey, if you feel like uh, joining us for a community night on Friday and playing some uh, playing some Jackbox and having some adult beverages, we'd love to have you. Okay, we were able to pick up those things because they're they're marked as X's now. They're not question marks, so. Wee! Boingy. The top of the vehicle is made out of rubber. Um. Oh no! Honestly thought that was gonna like damage me. Oh Jesus, oh God, oh no! Oh no, oh no, oh yeah! Now all these cultists should be gone, right? One of those vintage Togepi plushies. Oh! Oh no, they're still here. Well, at least they're not mad at me for taking away their leader. They might be in the other building. I have people on my team with biotics. I'm I'm not prejudiced against you. Don't worry. Father Kyle is in the uh, institution now, getting the help he needs. Oh no, there isn't anything in here. They're just looking at me like, why does that guy run like such a goober? Liara.
Oh yeah, there is still one more bingo prize available. Liara, are you all right? Liara is having a moment. You make your own designs and get voted on and then make them plushies. Oh, that's neat. She's doing a little dance. Your pilot can ask Alliance Command to send a patrol to collect Major Kyle. I just hope you know what you are doing, Shepard. Wait, didn't we already do that? I thought we did that. It's answer pants, answer pants. Yeah, yeah, oh, okay. I guess they just needed a second. Well, they don't seem to care when I take their stuff. Nobody's still here. I will surrender myself to the Alliance outside the compound gates in one hour, Commander. I give you my word. I thought we already did that. Yeah, that's what we're doing. There's no difference. Except the way it looks. Oh, I kind of like the way it looks better. I like the gray. So, I mean, if there's no difference in stats... That's why all the important people don't move. <laughs> Sounds about right.
No. I just went in a circle. Oh my god, I don't know how to leave. There it is. God damn. Maybe? Okay, yeah. Officially dry jumps. That place was confusing. Yes, Commander. Carry on, Presley. Yes, sir. How do I tell Command to come get him again? The quest is gone, like... Whatever, let's go to the fucking, uh... Hades Gamma. Sometimes quests glitch like that. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, there's really no reason for me to go back there. Oh, did quest locked you? Oh, no. No. Maybe it was Antaeus. I don't remember where the place was where the hidden zombies were. You got Otter Pops? I love Otter Pops. Do you have pits to burn, but think cheering is too mundane? Research base excavation. We have a wide yeah. variety of sound alerts and stream stickers from which you can select to interact with the stream in fun ways. Go ahead and give them a try. Okay, so yeah, we did do that. Yeah, this is where we were, where the hidden zombies were. Let me just double check this debris, and then we'll actually do the next uh, quest we got. Um, I got a huge box for like four bucks. If I go up to a uh, Sierra Highway, I can probably get a huge box for four bucks. Uh, that's where the hookers are. Uh, 
Okay, yeah. You'll you'll come to learn these things eventually. Oh yeah, there were the fuckers here that like attacked me. Fuck my face. Hades Gamma. I'll have to double check the name of this system, but the planet is Trebin. Uh, landmark Debris. West. Uh, electronics. That's against TOS. That's against TOS. Okay, now we can actually go do the next fucking, uh, quest. Also in, uh, the Hades Gamma cluster. All right, so this system is Antaeus. I wrote Angaeus because of course I did. Um, I'm also gonna mark that down for a full, a full drunken sweep. Um, so, this is where the other quest is. So let's double check our like, uh, let's double check our asteroid belt. While scanning this asteroid field, uh, asteroid field, you detected a large deposit of magnesium. Uh, Tunshagon. Tunshagon is a hydrogen helium gas giant with traces of chlorine and nitrogen in its atmosphere. It has an unusually small number of moons for a gas giant, a mere seven. This is no doubt due to the star Farinata capturing the majority of the mass during the nebular collapse that created the system. Uh, Gentalma. Gentalma is a small, broiling terrestrial world. Its thin atmosphere of carbon dioxide and ethane is being steadily blown off by the powerful solar wind from the star Farinata. The surface is scorching hot and mainly composed of sulfur with deposits of copper. Its density is low enough to leave the world tidally locked to Farinata. Uh, the Alliance Defense Data Network notes that several ships have been spotted cruising near Gintama with transponders turned off. While an Alliance patrol attempted to uh, pursuit of one, the unidentified vessel rabbited to FTL. Its trail was lost when it obscured its light trace in the confusion of signals along the uh, Anansi Ishtar shipping lane. We got a Prothean uh, data disk. Salvage team, uh, we found a derelict freighter in mid-stage orbital decay, and our salvage team went and got it. Perfect. There's a feather in our cap. Uh, Nepnu. Uh, with a rare combination of features, Nepnu is of particular interest to the scientific community. Nepnu is a small terrestrial planet with a thin atmosphere of carbon dioxide and krypton. As with all the worlds of Farinata, its surface is scorching hot. The crust mainly consists of silicates laced with iron. We're going to survey it. And we got thorium from a nearby moon. No other planets, so... The Ontario is a Colune class modular conveyor of human design, configured for mixed freight and passenger hauling. It is making a hard burn for the cover of an asteroid cluster. We're going to board it.
Because that's... That's this. It's a... Yeah. It, that's this quest. Hey, we got some armor. We got some Krogan armor for Rex. Okay. Kill the hostage. Oh. Oh shit. I will destroy you. Enemy is everywhere. Medic. Medic. Shields disabled. I will destroy you. Come on, motherfucker. Bring it on. Clear. That was a bitch. See how it is? You write letters and everyone ignores you. Force is the only thing people appreciate. So how about if I kill Chairman Burns and finish the charade? Please, I was trying to help you people. Calm down. Let's not do anything we're all going to regret. Why not? What have we got to lose? Since the chairman here decided that we didn't get reparations, we've got nothing left to live for. But I've changed my mind. Seeing you all, it's clear that you all deserve you had your chance. Some L2s are nearly crippled from side effects of the implants, but you voted against reparations. You need Burns. Think about this. Burns is the one man who can help you. Yes, if you release me, I can take another look at the reparations request. What, we're supposed to trust you? Sure, you promise us freedom and say everything will be fine, but as soon as we surrender, you'll double-cross us. I'm telling you the truth. I'm not promising to let you go. All I'm saying is that Burns will take another look. Right, Burns? Absolutely. I had no idea that the L2 biotics were this desperate. If I'd known, the reparations will come. For whatever it's worth, I promise that. Come on, do the right thing, man. You're right. I don't want to die. Maybe something will happen this time. We surrender. Thank you, Commander. I thought I was dead when they took me. I'll see to it that the reparations discussion is reopened. I didn't know they were so desperate. Not a problem. A fifth fleet cruiser will be by shortly to pick you and the prisoners up. We leveled up, by the way. Uh, let's take another charm point. Because holy shit, has that come in handy? Let's give you advanced barrier. Give you advanced marksman. Did good. I did good. 
Excellent mission to have your human to have your human boy on. Oh yeah, that might that might uh But we did it. We resolved the conflict peacefully. Kind of. Sort of. Kind of. After killing all of his friends. To be fair, they were shooting blue goop at me. To be fair. To be fair. They were shooting blue goop at me. Oh, also, um... I'm not sure if I told you, uh, Jay, uh, Bard is level 80, and, uh, Summoner Scholar is currently sitting at level 73, with, like, half of my roulettes left to do after stream. I am fucking chugging away. So by the time Dawn Trail drops, I will have one job in each of the five categories at level 90. So whenever I reach the point that roll quests start... I'll have jobs to fucking do them all right then and there. Because I can use roulettes to keep those three jobs caught up to Dragoon and Paladin. So Paladin and Dragoon will stay caught up during the MSQ and the yellow quests. So I can use roulettes to keep the other three jobs caught up to them. So I can keep my roll quests rolling. Get it? Keep my roll quests rolling. So I am, I am, I am... Through each expansion that I did, I found more and more efficient... Yes. Like, through each expansion that I did, I found more and more efficient ways to manage things, and Dawn Trail is going to be the most efficient yet. Alright, so we did it! Conflict resolved peacefully. That wasn't that bad at all. Message coming in. Passing it through. Thank you for dealing with the hostage situation, Commander. Chairman Burns was quite impressed by the way you resolved the situation peacefully. Your assistance above and beyond the function of the has been noted, Commander. Fuck yeah! They recognize game peacefully rather than peacefully. By the way, for anybody that isn't aware, you guys have that too. That's Taco Shot. Just making sure that you guys know that that's also a follower command. Yeah. You have to you have all three. You have rim shot, telco shot, and match rim shot. Yeah. You guys have pretty much all of my soundboard. All, any soundboard button I can push. There's only one you guys don't have. Um the the only one of my Bingo. the only one of my soundboard buttons that you guys don't have um is uh That's just for me. Um okay. <laughs> So these are all of our collection quests right here. And this is just in case we run into that weirdo Conrad. 
So we've got two more actual little side quests to do, and then we can get back to the mission. First. Whew. We got this one. This is the first one that we got. Um, a Rogue Six has taken over an Alliance training ground located on Earth's moon. So we're going to Earth's moon, guys. Yes, I do have a different Bazinga. Bazinga. That is the other one. Kind of. Your Bazinga sounds different from my Bazinga. Because between me and chat, I liked this one Bazinga. better. And chat liked Bazinga. that one better. So I was like, okay, I'll give you guys that one and I'll take the one I like. We're going to the moon! And that's the only system in our local cluster, right? That we can travel to? moon not to be confused with uh, Mercury a handful of solar power stations exist on peaks of eternal light at the north and south poles of Mercury the difficulties imposed by the planet's proximity to the Sun and high orbital velocity have limited development Venus. I'm your Venus! With its molten temperatures, sulfuric acid clouds, and crushing carbon dioxide atmosphere, Venus has only a handful of aerostat uh, research outposts. <coughs> we'll deal with Earth in a second. Mars. Once considered a prospect for terraforming and colonization, the discovery of faster than light travel turned Mars into a quiet backwater. Its southern pole is a historical preserve centered on the Prothean ruins found there. Immigration and development are restricted as the search for Prothean artifacts continues. Jupiter. Jupiter's deep gravity well and lethal radiation have kept its moons from being significantly exploited. The largest outpost is Binary Helix Corporation's Nautilus facility attached to the underside of Europa's ice sheet. I'm pretty sure we read these last week, but I wouldn't read them again. Saturn. Saturn has been a major source of helium-3 fuel for fusion planets, uh, fusion plants since the 2150s. The moon of Titan is mined for hydrocarbons and used as a hostile environment training facility for Alliance Marines. Also, anybody that isn't aware, we still have one more bingo to get. Get a fucking card. Um, use a hostile environment for training facility for Alliance Marines. Eagerness. After the development of Mass Effect FTL Drive, Distant Uranus was the target of a land rush to exploit its combination of plentiful helium-3 fuel and shallow for a gas giant gravity well. Today, Uranus is the largest producer of HE3 in Alliance space. Neptune. Though Neptune, like Uranus, is plentiful helium, its remoteness made it uh, an un promising target for mining before development of Mass Effect Drive. Um, with Uranus cheaper to exploit, it has never seen extensive development. The only permanent human presence is a small research uh, facility on Triton. I don't remember if we scanned our asteroid belt. Pluto is one of Sol's numerous ice dwarf worlds. It is mainly of note for being the gravitational anchor for the Prothean mass relay to Arcturus. Pluto and the Charon relay, formerly encased in ice and considered a moon, orbit each other. Pluto's orbit was, circu uh, was circularized in uh, 2157 as a side effect of the Charon mass relay recovery operations.
Earth. For detailed information, please refer to the standard issue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Luna! An early source of helium-3, Luna is now mined for materials used in space habitat construction. Two dozen major stations have been constructed at Earth's L4 and L5 Lagrange points, all from lunar resources. We're going to the moon. Moon! Clear my notifications here. Because eventually I'm gonna need to keep I'm gonna take a I'm gonna take a little break here in about twenty minutes, but I'm just making sure for later later. Moon pie? Moon moon, god damn it, moon moon. All right. Alliance training ground. Okay, so that's where we need to go. So I'm going to put this on the list. Because then we'll come back at some point and actually thoroughly explore here. But for, but we can go to this uh, debris real quick. So addicted to moon pies when I worked at Cabela's Bass Pro Shop because uh, employees got to take the take the nearly out of date ones home. Oh shit! I like moon pies. Oh, that's so neat that you can see Earth. Look at us on the moon and shit. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Let's take let's let's take some cover here. Let's take some cover here. One down.
keep some cover here. Okay, 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 okay. Our shields are in remarkably good shape. Excuse the fuck out of me? Remember this mission later. Shit. Shit. What? I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> work canceled this morning, so I wasted fuel driving to work and back. Then I wanted to work on my course, but my mother went to the sea today and left my wife. It didn't auto save when I went into the thing. course, but my mother went to the city today and left my wife with my grandmother, so she went back until 7 p.m. Oh, jeez. I'm sorry, dude.
And honestly, I want to change my assault rifle. What do I have on right now? I have the shredder rounds four on. version of the Twitch app because it hasn't changed aside from the story social. Okay. Fucking hard to save. No, but I want an assault rifle with more of a burst to it. No. That's going to be much better.
Okay. No, motherfucker. Okay. Of course, I want to work on is uh, C. I'm trying to. Oh, nice. Maybe in some of those contracts might get me out of the oil field. Oh, that'd be neat. That'd be a damn good time. All right, now that we've got everybody good and like outfitted, let me though, uh, let me double, let me really. <laughs> Let's give her the even better one of those. I need to find new armor that she can actually equip. I need to, like, find something for her. Let's give her the ablative uh, coating. Let's do one more save, because 13 is unlucky. I don't actually believe that bullshit, but it's an excuse to save again. Um... I can still afford to live, right? I would say that's the American dream, but you're Canadian. It's the North American dream. I mean, if you're just going to give it, I'm saving so much. Because I didn't like where it auto saved me. It wasn't a very convenient place. We need to find you some better armor stat. I have a decent amount of money now. We can actually go buy some good armor for these two. Once we're done here, we're going to go buy, we're going to go back to the Citadel and buy some decent armor for these two. Okay, one more save before we actually walk into the room there. So that way if we die, we just pop back in. The Citadel. Oh yeah, I can talk to the guy. I mean, we have to go to the Citadel to turn in uh, some quests eventually. Shit. Here it comes. Hostiles 
hostile spot. can fly you know what Back up, back up, back up, you two. They are pain. They are bottlenecking them. Was the strat though? That bottlenecking them was damn sure the strat. Once I thought about the layout, I was like, I can bottleneck them into that hallway. So that way they can't get around behind me. Because what was fucking me up was they were getting, like, they were surrounding me. So it's like, I need to keep them in one direction from me. Like, I need to make sure I control where I'm, where I'm facing them down at. Okay. There's a lot of exclamation points. Oh no. All targets eliminated. But if we have our helmets on, we're fine, right? Like, do they want us to destroy these?
Destroy the conduits. Yeah, cause we've got we've got our helmets and shit on now, so it's like we're protected from that toxic gas they're talking about. Yeah, so they want me to destroy these. All targets eliminated. Can't even minimize the stream to see who's online. Oh, that's dumb. The lights on the optical mainframes flicker and die. The first of the three computing clusters containing the six is offline. All right. Well, that's one down, two to go. want me to just wreck the place. We're just gonna wreck the place. I'm gonna, I'm gonna wreck it. Um, that's what I said to that booty. Um, Oh, but we leveled up. I want to get shotguns open because I want to keep shotguns as I want to get my shotgun as my secondary. I like I I, I me likey boomstick. I'm gonna save here real quick. And then I'm gonna do it. I've been I've been live for about two hours. I'm gonna take a quick DJ Pikachu break. Um So you guys enjoy the uh Me likey boomstick. You guys uh enjoy the talented DJ Pikachu. He was a true and I will be back shortly. Potatoes. Is this the first time you see a friend die in battle? This is part of what it means to be a ninja. Kill 
Subscribe to 171st Street Games. You can enjoy ad-free viewing, along with an assortment of fun emotes and a set of exclusive subscriber-only video commands in chat. Show your support and subscribe today. Come on, what do you say? Hmm, tempting. I'm curious to see how you intend to back up such brave words. Show me, Kakashi! Oh. 
potatoes. Okay. Here comes the boy. Hello, boy. Welcome. Here we come. There he is. Here comes the boy. Welcome. There he goes. Here he comes. There he is. Welcome, boy. Here's the boy. Think we're good, Commander. It's the same, it's just a different color. I like the gray though. I kind of like the little camo gray on there. Back. Uh, got calmed down and got food. Uh, it's not fully thawed yet, but grape uncrustables. Nice. Stuck in my head. Me, um, Saturday, during, like, you know, when, like, on Saturdays, uh, like, I hang out with my mom. We have, like, you know, family bonding time and shit. And, um, we watched this documentary on, uh, Disney Plus about the Beach Boys. And it was actually really neat. So I've had, like, Beach Boys songs stuck in my head all week. That was a really neat little documentary. We liked it. All right, okay. All right, they're moving in, they're moving in, they're moving in, they're moving in, guys. I'm hitting my fucking... Like I was hitting my goddamn button. Okay. There's a slobber knockers in here. Get my glass of milk. Nice. Have a cassette tape of the Beach Boys. That's fucking cool. I, um, <sighs> 
for uh, karaoke, I've done uh, Kokomo. Um, I think that's it. I should do some more uh, Beach Boys for fucking uh, karaoke. Backlog's never gonna die. Not if you fucking guys have anything to say about it. Um, let's see. Okay. So let's save. Okay. Let's destroy, just destroy some more of these fucking things. Back up a bit. Oh, dag nabbit. Each one has like a dumb little defense mechanism. The first one was toxic gas, which didn't really affect us. Because we are in uh, spacesuits. And now it's just fucking kinetic barriers. All right, the second cluster is offline. So it's saying, bye. Aw, that's cute. Bye. Okay, bye. Y'all wanna laugh? Always. Jinx. Looked like a fucking, uh... Dumbass Tesla truck for a second before the textures loaded. Right? right. I'm so gay, I've surrounded myself with somebody else. I forgot straight people go. existed. Ha! <laughs> Yep. I'm sorry you had to see that dog ass ugly thing.
They look like fucking PS1 vehicles with no textures loaded. They're so dumb. Like, I don't know how a person can drive one of those and think they look cool. Like, oh, I look fucking cool now. I'm such a, I'm such a cool fucking guy. Look at me driving around a fucking gray version of the fucking world map buggy from Final Fantasy 7. Uh, it's it's so bad. So stupid. The back had a QR code that took up the entire right half of it. Mario style letters for my state's Tesla club and some other dumbass sticker. There's a whole bunch of dude bros. Of course it was. They're probably, like, all into crypto and shit. Yo, I got 3,000 credits out of that bitch! Okay, I don't want... to open those again if I die, and you're telling me that, I guess... I'm not allowed to save in here now. I'll come back out to the surface to save. Why can't I save? Thank you. I smell trouble. Okay. I think we're done here. Tolly. <laughs> that was I'm right here. Ready. I smell trouble! Make it double? Um. Instagram account on it and the bitch who owns it shot it. Jesus. Held the door open for me when I was taking the five guys over that. Yeah, at least they're polite. The truck is riddled with bullets. I think I've seen a TikTok of that one. I think I saw someone make a TikTok video of that one like it was in a parking lot. This is gonna suck. Jesus, tap dancing Christ. They were all cluster fucked around the thing. Oh, that was, that was, that was an ordeal. That was a fucking ordeal. But we did it. We did it. Me and these two bad bitches did it. It's the same one. It is the same one. You've seen the TikTok? Oh, it's so stupid.
Um, also... Use any of them you want. I want them to have free reign to just automatically use their fucking skills when they see fit. Clear. I trust them. They don't just need to use the defensive ones. They can use the offensive ones too. I fucking trust them. Just in case I need to give myself a little time here. Alright, get in, get in, get in. Get in the room, get in the room, get in the room. Okay. The truck is based in my hometown. She lives up here part-time. Jesus Christ. Reminds me of the basis for Pearl Jam lives. The basis for Pearl Jam lives where you are? Um, down the freeway from uh, here, like down the 14, there's a uh, big, like, kind of big, not quite a mansion, but a big giant house up on a hill uh, that one of the Beastie Boys used to live in. A burst of white noise over all frequencies nearly deafens you. Your hard suit's heads-up display interprets it into a series of... Uh, it's, it's, it's a series of binary. They repeat again and again, blanketing all frequencies until the lights on the final six cluster flicker and die. Specialization class achieved. Your specialization class will replace your base class in the talents on the SWAD screen. Talent ranks in your base class transfer over to your specialization class. Go to your squad screen to view the bonuses you gain with each rank in your specialization. Oh! Shock Trooper. Highly trained killing machines. Shock Troopers excel in all combat situations. Increased health, increased damage protection, improves the immunity or barrier ability, improves the adrenaline ability. Commanders rely on lethal if efficiency and precision strikes rather than brute force to eliminate their opponents. Increased damage of all weapons, improves immunity. Do you have bits to burn but think cheering is too mundane? We have a wide variety of sound alerts and stream stickers from which you can select to interact with the stream in fun ways. Go ahead and give them a try. So this is the blue tunic or the red tunic in Link's Awakening. That's what this is. This is Link's Awakening uh, DX. Do you want the blue tunic or the red tunic? And I'm thinking I want the blue tunic. You guys know me. I am very defense oriented. I'm 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 I am very good with battles of attrition. Like this is this is this is my tanky specialization class. This is my DPS specialization class. And I think I'm going tanky. I think I'm going tanky boy. That's fucking rad, though. That's wicked. Like, fucking... Got my specialization class. Because I'm level 25. Fuck yeah. Shock! Shock! Shock the monkey! And I'm not sure if I really want to give a shit about, uh shotguns right now because that that didn't really help me much i think i want more shit in this um you up your electronics you up your decryption and get more shit So much shit. Just ate and I'm feeling good. Glad to hear it. So, so that, sometimes that just helps so much. 
Just getting some just getting some food in your tummy. About a half hour, forty five minutes, I'll have some food over here. We're doing a we're doing a, a thing, it's called a Mexican skillet supper. It's got like seasoned meat and like peppers and onions and shit. You just do it all up in a skillet, you do it with like some tortilla chips to kinda give it some kind of like it's almost like a, it's almost like a like a like a like a skillet casserole almost and then you can get some actual like tortilla chips out of the bag and like scoop it up pretty good it feels so good i'm glad this morning i took um an everything shower I had a shower streamer oh nice I'm glad you're able to do that for yourself. All right, we're going back to the Normandy, guys. And then um, we're gonna report in that we got that shit taken care of because I think we got that over the radio. Or no, I guess we're not. Let me see what it wants me to do. Oh no, it's just done. It's just complete. We did it and it's complete. They know we did it. We're good. So then, Admiral uh, Kahoku... Oh yeah, this is the one... This is the one we just grabbed at the beginning of stream that I was telling you guys about yesterday that I accidentally stumbled upon when I tried to do some off-screen... Uh, off-stream exploring. 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 Exploring! I do words real fucking good. Um, Victorian era music, vampire gothic, nice. Um, but yeah, the very first thing we did last Wednesday, uh, not last Wednesday, like, when we went out and, um, the first Thresher Maw we fought, remember there was that phony... There was that phony beacon, and we found all the dead Alliance troopers. We had to kill the big sandworm. And then after, uh, at the end of stream last Thursday, we went and told uh, Admiral Kahoku that we found his, his soldiers, we found his platoon, and they were lured out by a phony signal. Then at the beginning of stream today, he told us, hey, there's this group called Cerberus that did it. They're like a fucking... Uh, super awful bad group and now Admiral Kahoku has to go into hiding because they're going to be after him next uh, so we have to go take them the fuck down they are in the Yangtze system in the Voyager cluster so let's go to the Voyager cluster Voyager cluster I barely know her cluster um But I do want to talk to my quartermaster. I want to eat, but I'm not hungry. I'm craving rice. Ooh. Get yourself some rice. Got a stupid Twitch related question? There are no stupid questions. Okay, that's a lie, but I doubt your question is stupid. It's not worth it. I just could sell that. That's definitely not as good. Fuck that. Um, you can have that. You can definitely have that. You can have that.
Um, Just in case I decide I want to use my pistol for anything. So make sure everybody got the best equipment that I'm currently carrying. Prioritize Liara and Tali, obviously, because they're like my... What, 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 what? What's the diamond logo next to someone who pulls the names? Oh, yeah, that's a VIP badge. I pretty much kind of use it, um, for, like, I kind of use it for, like, diet mods. Like, when you see, when you see that badge on somebody, just kind of think of them as, like, a lesser mod. They have certain they have certain abilities with certain commands, like they can do shout outs and shit. Um just in case there aren't any like mods around. Um but I use yeah, I use VIPs as like uh not quite mods, like deputies. Diet mods. That's a straight upgrade. He can only use light armor.
That's a straight upgrade for you. Do we have anything better? No, this is just a straight ass upgrade for you. Yeah, this is boring as shit. I'm sorry. <laughs> Just before I start selling a bunch of shit. Oh, of course. Oh, yeah. Never, never be scared to ask stuff. Looking for supplies? Yes. Let's see what you've got. You Show me what you've got. I want to sell. Yeah, that's just one. They're the same. It's just I'm not a fan of the coloration. So sell, sell. I think upgrades, I'm not going to sell. Well, I can sell really low level upgrades. I'm going to sell really low level upgrades. I wish there was a way I could fucking uh, sort. And that heavy armor is just not as good at all. Hey, look. There we go. Let's go to all these level one shits. And stuff that I have equipped is not going to show up here, right? I would assume. Ah, whoa. Shit. Looking for supplies? Let's see what you've got. You bet, man. They yelled at me about something. Okay, perfect. I've got everybody equipped with, like, the best stuff they can be equipped with right now. So, like, all of this low-level shit, I'm just gonna fucking toss. There we go. Up through, like, level three. Stuff like up through level three. Well, now let's do it by type. Um... Because the armors, absolutely, I can sell all the fucking armors. Because I've got everybody in the best... And I've got my entire party. And I've got everybody with their best weapons. So let's keep 
the uh, upgrades just in case I find that swapping upgrades might be a decent idea. So we'll keep the level 4 and level 5 upgrades just in case it seems like maybe swapping upgrades around might help certain situations. Oh, that's a pretty penny. Um, I really kind of want to look at armor. Um, let me mainly... It sucks that it, that it doesn't show everybody. Like, I wish it would show me everybody. So let me go take a look. It's mainly Liara and Tally I'm worried about. What is your current armor? You have Gladiator 1. So let me just make a quick note. I bet I can find something better than this. Um... 1249 0. Um, Fuzzy Pickles, just for my. Wait, no, I could probably find this out. Well, no, I probably can't. I'd have to actually have her in my party. Uh, Fuzzy Pickles, if somebody like. Uh, Frere, you're probably looking at the wiki right now, it sounds like. Can you just tell me what type of armor Liara and Tali can equip? I know Liara's light armor. Liara is light armor human, but I don't know if there's anything else. Tali has... A Hydra one armor. And it is fucking five... 49-12. Fucking pitiful. Pitiful! Awful. Those are rookie numbers. You gotta pump those numbers up. Got juice. What kind of juice? I thought you were getting milk. Got rice started. Nice. Pomegranate cherry juice. Oh, I love pomegranate cherry. Tali's armor rarely drops from loot, and you can get some in the Citadel. What kind, though? Like, what's the type? Like, is it specifically... Will it specifically say her species? Looking for supplies? Let's, Let's see what you've you got. Bet, Show me what you've got. Just quarrying for Tally? Okay. So it will say quarrying for Tally. Liara is light human, right? She can't equip medium armor, I don't think. Like, we'll go back to the Citadel right now. Liara is light armor? Light armor human. Because she's very human shaped. Oh, this isn't bad. I've got 177k. This is only 11.8. And what is her current? 1249. This is exponentially better than what Liara, especially in the shields. Liara's, the stats on Liara's current armor are 1249-0. This almost this more than triples her shields and it actually gives her tech biotic protection 
I gotta remember, her numbers aren't gonna look like mine, because it's light armor. I'm in heavy armor. Like, she's not tanky. Liara ain't tanky. She's not gonna have high damage protection numbers like me. But though th that shield number is fucking magnificent. That's what we want to see. So let's, let's put that on her, and then I'll sell her shitty one that she currently is wearing. Yeah, look at that. Look at that shit. Look at how good that, oh. Oh. You beautiful blue bad bitch. You actually got some protection now. Oh, it's so good. And we'll go sell that. And then we'll go looking for supplies to the Citadel real quick to see what they have for Kiara uh, or for uh, Tali. That is, it is a lot better. She is a lot better equipped now. She can actually take some fucking hits. She won't go down like a sack of potatoes. Like, I was feeling bad when we were fighting those damn drones. Because Liara, Liara and Tali were getting their asses kicked. Like, I, I, needed, I need to invest in better armor for them. And now I am. We're taking care of our girls. Okay, let's head back to the Citadel before we go romping to, uh... It's, uh... Where's that other quest they want us to go to? It's the Yangchi system. It's Voyager, Artemis Tau... Exodus, or I mean Yangshi Cluster. Where's the Yangshi Cluster? I'll double check that. Maybe I read that wrong. <laughs> Meow. Equalizing interior pressure oh. with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. All right.
Presidium technicians are struggling to understand why a computer system catastrophically overloaded recently. Technicians are reportedly unsure of what caused the malfunction, or even what the system was originally designed to do. CSEC is investigating the possible vandalism or misuse of public property. New side quest? No. Just some bullshit. Um, Commander Shepard? Yes. Police have been seen in Al Jalani, West Truman News. Okay. Can you answer a few questions for our viewers? All right. What do you want to know? You've been given a unique position to represent our race. People want to get a sense of how you'll do that. Humans have been trying to get the respect of the galactic community for 26 years. With that in mind, what are your feelings on being the first human Spectre? Honored. The Spectres represent the best of every species in the galaxy. To be asked to join them is an honor. Some have said your appointment is the Citadel throwing humans a bone. Have you encountered any situations where the Citadel asked you to place its needs before the needs of Earth? It's not like that. The Council is concerned with the needs of the whole galactic community. We're part of that community now. Our needs are on their agenda, but we're one of many. You really do believe that, don't you? You've been given command of an advanced human warship for your missions. Is there anything you'd like to say about it? Turians help build it. Actually, the Normandy was co-developed by human and Turian engineers. Its design incorporates many innovations, all of which are classified, I'm afraid. So the Turians have knowledge of the Normandy that is being kept secret from the Alliance public? Do you think it was appropriate to hand Earth's most advanced warship over to the Citadel? The crew is still Alliance. <laughs> Time to shut you up! <laughs> this interview is over. No, the crew is still Alliance. I wasn't aware it had been handed over to anyone. I'm in command, and last I checked, I'm human. Same goes for my crew. Human, yes, but you do work for the Citadel now, Commander. One last question, Commander. Rumors back home say you're tracking a rogue specter named Saren. Do you have any comment on that? I think this I play diplomatically. I can't confirm or deny that. Like, I think this one I actually need to play close to the vest. I'm afraid I can't comment on whatever my current assignment may or may not be. Don't worry. We'll find out. The eyes of Earth are on you. Don't let us down. Thank you for your time, Commander Shepard. I think I was pretty forthright with her, except that last question, there's no way, like, no, fuck you, I can't, I'm not gonna give you, that's an ongoing investigation, and it's like, kind of top secret. Like, I'm forthright, but me telling you that could endanger the mission. That's dumb. How dare you ask me that? <laughs> Whatever your long, stupid name was. Hello, Commander. Give him a heads up. You don't want him having eyes. Yep. I need supplies. Show me what you've got. Show me what you've I'll got. In the rare stocks for you. Type. Ooh! I'll take that. Um, oh no. Oh, that's the one that, uh... That's the one Lia- Oh no, this is better for Liara. Oh my god, that is better for Liara. This is Scorpion 6. Oh no! I made a mistake. That's much better for Liara. Um... Damn. Damn! It's fine. Fuck it, it's fine. Now this one's actually better than mine. 
I can afford it, but damn, that's gonna run me dry. Um, but here's the BRB screen. Um, I have food to go grab. While I decide if this is worth it, and I will be right back. Potatoes! How did you survive? I didn't have a choice. I had to live. I wanted to come home to you. So, I sang your song. Our song. Cool. That was a good game. That was a good video game. I'm off. It's the one that Garnet saw. It's the big giant eyeball that Garnet saw when she was fleeing Need a break from the ads? If you subscribe to 171st Street Games, you can enjoy ad-free viewing, along with an assortment of fun emotes and a set of exclusive subscriber-only video commands in chat. Show your support and subscribe today. Okay. Hey! Ignis knows how to make fish sticks now. What is he, a gay fish? I couldn't help it. Ich hab mir nun ein Auto so gelegt. Damit ist dein Nachstrat auch ganz unordentlich zum Riefen nach. Es sei denn, ich rasse doch mit. Verschein profund. Bella learns crack. Bella learned a spell called crack. Hey, Bella, you learned crack. Oh, Bella's going to have to use crack on someone. It's going pretty good, cutie. We're having a good time. We're hunting for spooky ghosts. Yellow Take it. <laughs> Where'd you put it? Noise. Where did you put the other spear marks, sir? I threw oh, them yeah, both on the shelves. Hey, I can see hey. them. They might hey, be on the ground. I don't know. Oh. Why? What? Who doesn't, who doesn't have their head cam? Uh, no. right now. Who is Sephiroth? Sephiroth just tipped me a hundred dollars. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening anymore. That's that's currently 47 songs. Um so community and family. Toad's the strong boy. Toad is the strongest boy. He picks up things the fastest. Potatoes. But he jumps the. Oh, was it a? Was it? Was it another classic clip of me and Bella yelling at each other? What up, Ashar?
How are ya? It's good to be back. All right. You know what? Let's remember that's there. Now let's check the other shops and see if we can find anything for Tali because she desperately needs better armor. More than I need an upgrade. Oh, my wife wrote LARP hasn't got back to me yet. Oh, no! I hope you hear from him. There's still a ways out, though. Like, two weeks. You got time to hear from him. Michael, it's my decision. I don't think anything, bitch. I know you're hurting, Rebecca, but don't let your grief hurt your baby, too. Is there a problem? Can I help you with anything? Perhaps you could talk some sense into her. I don't need anyone to talk sense into me, Michael. I'm not undergoing the treatments. My sister-in-law here is pregnant, and she's refused to let the baby undergo gene therapy in utero. Why? I thought gene therapy was common. My husband Jacob died from a rare heart condition several months ago. There's a chance that the baby could develop the same heart condition, but routine gene therapy can eliminate it. A very small chance, Michael. And extranet reports say the therapy could harm the child. It's less dangerous than the genetic enhancements that every soldier in the Alliance receives. Let her choose. It's Rebecca's child, Michael. I think you should honor her decision. Damn it, she's not choosing. She's acting blindly out of grief. It's still her choice. I know you want the best for your brother's child, but this isn't your decision. Of course it is. I'm the closest thing to a father this baby is going to have. Red flags. Listen to what you said. Is this about keeping the baby safe, or is this about you losing your last link to your brother? This baby is the only thing my brother... It's all I have left of him. I need to know... But it's not your baby. Be safe. And you're kind of being creepy about it. You're her brother, not her husband. I just want Jacob's child You're not the father of the kid. I want to give him that much. We will. I promise. Thank you for talking with us. I appreciate it. That better give me some fucking Paragon points. Dano, yeah, no, much like much like myself, Commander Kino Shepard is one thousand percent uh, pro choice. In all regards. Commander, it is good to see you again. Would you care to see some of its fantastic items today? I'd like to buy something. Show me your items. Oh, this one is pleased. Non-human armors. You will not be disappointed. I better not be. I'll start blasting.
I mean, you gotta let me vent it uh, some way. This is decently better than what she's got equipped. God, it's the only thing they've got! Okay, put a pin in that. There's still another shop to check. The hell? Oh. There's still another shop to check. Getting a bad migraine? Oh, do that. May rest your eyes. Glad you were able to hang out with us for a bit. Okay. Welcome back, Miss Clan. Will you be needing Show me what you've got. Most excellent. Oh, shit. Welcome back, Earth Clan. Show me what you've got. Show me what you've got. Most excellent. Oh yeah, good. This isn't as good as the one that I already found for her. Okay, good. I was gonna I was about to be pissed. Isn't it? I'll do my best. Being a Spectre is a big responsibility. I just want to make humanity proud. The vids are all talking about Commander Shepard fighting for all of us back home. And they also say that you don't take crap from anybody. You're showing them what humans can do. Hey, can I get your picture? I suppose. I don't have a problem with it, but why? You're a hero, Shepard. Decades from now, humanity's going to remember you, and I'll have your picture. Just hold up your gun. Perfect. Thanks again, Commander. I'm gonna hang this in my living room. My wife will love it. A few of my people have visited here on their pilgrimage. But their descriptions of the wards hardly do them justice. Everyone here seems so busy, so rushed. I wonder if they are happy. Yo, though! Liara, Liara looking, Liara looking like a proper trooper now. Got yourself a fanboy. I know, he was a... Uh... Once again, where's the uh, red flags guy when we need him? Hello there. Welcome to Moreland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? I need supplies. Let me see what you have. Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Very good things I have. You will see. Nine human armors.
Okay, we don't have anything for uh, Tali. Hello there. Welcome to Moreland's famous shop. Do you want anything? Let me see what you have. Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Very good things I have. Yes. Yes. Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite shop. Batty, I get to monster. Oh yeah, that's right. You're doing a you're doing a, a, a monster RP. Um, okay. So we're gonna go get Tali. The one armor that we could find for her because it is a straight upgrade. And then we'll get me uh, the one from CSEC. Drop, drop top. I am Rick Harrison. This is my pawn shop. Um, Commander, show me your items. Oh, this one is pleased to do so. Nine seventy seven sixteen. Yeah. It is a straight up upgrade. It's just not as much as I would have liked. We need to find some better fucking Quarian armor. Oh wait, no, I still got another guy to go shop with. I gotta go buy my thing. Would you care to see some of its fantastic items today? I think I'll be going. Return soon. So the in-character reason why half of the animal disappears is that we are on maneuvers. For your LARP? Go to CSEC. I liked you. It was like Appa from Avatar The Last Airbender. Appa! Yip yip! Hello, Commander. Show me what you've got. I'll open the rare stocks for you.
Yeah, it was that Scorpion 6 that's better than what I've got. And I'll take anything I can get. And I can just barely afford it, so... Show me what you I'll open the rare stock. And here's our uh not quite as good armor. I'm walking away from this with 15,000 credits. My new orc mask, nice. Now I would be now I would be uh Aang from Last Airbender. Yeah. I like the Last Airbender. Um Alliance officials have raided a dangerous cult controlled by a former Alliance officer, Major Kyle. We did that. Major Kyle surrendered and is now being treated for severe post-traumatic stress disorder. We got him the help he needed. We're good noodles. Good beans. Stand by shore party. Decontamination in progress. Special beans. Because we have Lord, special eyes. The commanding officer. My brand. Exo Presley stands relieved. Look what Avatar box set. So I need to bust out my kiddo so I can experiment. Oh hell yeah! It is time. It is time for the small one to experience the fucking magic. All right. Yangshi system in the Voyager cluster. Okay, we're going to the Voyager cluster. I barely know her cluster. I already made that joke earlier, but I don't give a fuck. Um, on Bintu. It's Bintu in the Yangshi system. Okay. Message coming in. What? Patching it through. Thank you, Joker. Commander Ms. Algelani's story on you just aired. She shouldn't have ambushed you like that. But you handled it pretty well. Yes! I did the best I could. We had differences of opinion, sir. I hope she at least believed my sincerity. You handled yourself pretty well, Commander. She came across like a raving idiot. Just wanted to let you know what the response was back home. I won't keep you any longer. Fifth Fleet out. Good. I'm glad I was smart about that because I had a feeling that would have consequences. Let's remember makeup or or gear. Hell yeah. And we gotta go. Excuse me. Uh, Voyager. We're doing it. <sighs> Ren Shadow. I'm thirsty. Refreshing. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I needed a little bit more than that quick. Thanks for making me actually do it. Oh, okay. 
Woo! That's nice. Renchado is a close orbiting hot Jupiter with traces of sulfur. It's hydrogen in its... There's a word missing from that sentence. That wasn't me. With traces of sulfur in its hydrogen helium atmosphere. The disruptive gravity well of the gas giant prevented any planets from forming nearby. That's the planet we have to land on. Draeger is a small barren rock world with trace atmosphere of Krypton and Xenon. The surface is frigid and mainly composed of silicates with deposits of magnesium, aluminum, and other light metals. Draeger has a weak magnetic field making it unsuitable for drive discharge operations. Just before a planet landing, yup. By the way, just to remind everybody, if you don't have a bingo card, we still have one bingo win available for two sub coupons. What quick? That two of the, uh... Well, yeah, because... It'd be funny if you get one, though. Light metal surveyed. Scans from orbit have detected a large deposit of beryllium. Patajiri. Patajiri has a thin atmosphere composed of neon and chlorine. Its frozen surface is mainly composed of silica with deposits of copper. During the long cold night, the chlorine in the atmosphere falls to the ground in the form of frost. Survey. Rare element surveyed. We got a uh, large deposit of thorium. Alrumter. <laughs> Alrumter. Arumter is a small, rocky terrestrial planet with a trace atmosphere of nitrogen and krypton. Its frigid surface is mainly composed of light metals with deposit, deposits, areas of frozen ammonia. That's also written. There's a lot of weird typos in this game. Prothean disk data. All right. We detected a weak signal coming from the far side of the planet Arumter. Joker brought the Normandy around, and your salvage team picked up a small escape pod trapped in orbit. There was a long dead terrain inside, along with a few personal items and a Prothean data disc. We're kind of kicking ass on these collection quests. First bingo, the first shimmy. Yeah! Frere got it real quick, and then uh, Aaron got the second one. Yeah, are you keeping your same... Okay, cool. Binthu has an atmosphere of carbon dioxide with a permanent haze of toxic chlorine and clouds of sulfur dioxide that periodically drop torrents of acidic rain on the surface. Its crust is mainly composed of sulfur with deposits of calcium. Like most worlds in the Voyager cluster, Binthu has only been charted within the last 20 years by Alliance surveyors. It has no known native ecology. Data about the world is surprisingly uh, brief and generic, painting a picture of an unpleasant and uninteresting place. Well, let's go find these Cerberus fuckers and uh, make them fucking eat the barrel of our gun. And make them suck it like a dick. Uwu. Uwu. All right. No, stop it. <clears throat> research facility, research facility, research facility. Uh, debris anomaly. Anomaly. 
anomaly. Um, and we've got a fucking mineral deposit right in front of us. So let's do this mineral deposit. Then we'll do the debris. Then we'll go to that anomaly. And we'll check the research uh, facility. Right by that southern anomaly. We found a palladium deposit. All right. Oh wait, also, because we're just gonna straight boop, boop, boop these things, we're not gonna comb. I'm gonna add this to the list of uh, Voyager cluster. Yangchi system. Planet Binted. Add that to the list of uh, You really do sound like the Redeemer. Um, with my card. Yeah. This is my gone foul little demon. There you go. So we have to come back here eventually anyway, when, uh, once we get, uh, once I take some time and really fucking focus in on these two's electronics and decryption skills. I need to start just pumping points into electronics and decryption for a bit so we can stop running into this problem. So I've got this planet on both lists. stupid thing in the land of me dealing with my aunt. Oh, no! What happened? Okay, let's go to this anomaly. And then we'll go to that research facility. They've got turrets, so... We're going to be... F oh, they're already firing at me. Sir? Oh, shit. Wait, I will be with that anomaly in a second. A fucking mineral deposit popped up on my map. I mean... Ah! That one actually damaged me. I, okay, I'll give... Yeah. Yeah, that's... Yeah. 
Yeah, I deserved that one. Yay, we got some uranium. Ready. Uranium fever. Touching a lot of love. Um. Got to Lena Mirna. She got us all signed up for this phone tracker app so he can have his location on. Not the whole point was for her. Like, the more you tell me about your aunt, like, I'm sorry, the more she sounds like the whole raging fucking psycho. Like, absolute, like, micromanaging control freak. Oh, it's gonna be so good when you fucking leave. Okay. So one more fucking turret over there. And I can't like safely explore this thing. Where is it? Oh no, it's dead. It's gone. What is it, at the top of the pyramid? We got a Prothean data disc. There are a few children's toys and some ragged clothes stuffed inside the top of this monument, along with a Prothean data disc. Perfect. We done fucking good. That's the plan. Good news, everyone. Quick happens with him being big mega bitch. Constantly tells me where she's going with my grandpa, so I don't freak out. Like, why would you freak out? Made it to Endwalker. Nice. Congrats. Cognarts. Let us know when you get to any, like, trials and shit. I will be glad to uh, jump in on trials with you. No longer Sprout. Your Sprout is gone. Okay. We're gonna save.
with a Geiger counter in my hand, I'm going out to stake me some government land. Uranium fever has done and got me down. Don't trust God cues are gonna suck. I don't know how Fridays are gonna look if it's the same way. Um, we can improvise. We'll try that first week of Dawn Trail. We'll see how it impacts stream. Um, and play it by ear. If we have to change the format on Fridays for about a month or so, let everybody kind of run the fuck through it. Let the hardcore players fucking get it out of their system we just changed formats for a bit I'm, I'm good at improvising the schedule what up man kitten how you doing summer's almost upon us June 6th is my kiddo's last day so that means I can come oh nice well make sure you make sure you uh you make that uh that fucking uh DoorDash money Good, how are you? It's been so long. Uh, we're doing pretty good. We're going on space adventures. Oh, shit, the fucking bed. I gotta be more careful. Thanks, thanks, Kino. Thank you. Countermeasure deployed. Locked and low. She can I take care of that one. You. Tally. Oh, this. Oh, that wasn't Tully. <laughs> I thought it was Tally. <laughs> um, best kind of adventures? Hell yeah. Doing uh, 7 to 2.30, so I should be able to get my uh, $100 daily gold. Nice. Turn a Mass Effect tabletop RPG. That would be fun. Back and have eaten. What did you eat? Up my Spectre training, fuck it. And up my Shock Trooper. Um, I'm gonna... I'm pumping you two with fucking... Electronics and Decryption. Because that is... Really helping me. Um... Leftover spaghetti, nice. Spaghetti heats up really well. Like, reheats. Like, spaghetti reheats really well. Forgot about my rice. Oh, shit! So she should be here any minute. What the hell? Oh, shit. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Had to swap out the batteries. So these ones, these ones come off the charger, and those ones go on the charger. Won't get 
gonna be next to me. That's a fucking lie, Kino. This should slow them down. You must die. Look out! We're gonna have to kill that thing, aren't we? You've eliminated the threat at this facility. Continue one of the other nearby labs. Okay, so yeah. Gun is new. We have to take out these weird ass, like, bio weapons they're creating. Looks like Cerberus has other bases on this world, Shepard. Yeah, I know. We're gonna do it. Session one is a job interview for Mercy. Do you have to burn but think sharing is too mundane? We have a wide variety of sound alerts and stream stickers from which you That's can select it. to interact with the stream in fun ways. Go ahead and give them a try. My brother has been running a, um... Or involved in an, uh... And, 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 and FF. An FF campaign. He was telling me about a weird, I need to get the details from him again, but like a weird, like, black mage build he's, uh, working on. Thankful my rice cooker auto turns to the warm setting after a while. Oh, good! Much more fluffy. Hey, good fluffy rice. Fucking drizzle some soy sauce on there. Oh, fuck. That's good fucking iced tea. Good rice cooker. Alright. So now which base are we going to? Let's go... Well, that one's the closest. Boy, oh boy, here I go killing again. Alright, gotta get myself a good vantage point with some cover. I think I've got it. Let me just get eyes on the compound. There we go. Get eyes on their turrets. Back up, back up, because it's on N-A-T-E and me. The war into the G. Whoop, back up. Okay, they, they hit me. Okay, whatever. I, I'm, I'm, sir, you died. Missile me from beyond the scrapyard? Bullshit. Is it like an FF? It's just general FF. Kind of like how Final Fantasy XIV is, like, generally inspired by the series. <laughs> we like killing. Which way did he go, George? Which way did he go? Which way did he go, George? Which way did he go? Um... Come on, Commander Purple Hair and Pronouns, let's go.
Come on, advance on me. Be as aggro as the drones were. We're gonna get Ren Kino like he no mercy with God. Final Fantasy in general. Yeah. I mean, shared continuity, kind of. Like, within trilogies. Okay, now I pissed him off. Okay. Oh, that's, that's Liara l using the, uh... See, that's why I'm glad I set them to just use their abilities as they see fit. Things are going much more smoothly. Like, I don't want to have to manually order them to do that. Like, Liara knows what she's doing, it's fine. Liara's got this. Bye. Oh, shit. At least they're dropping a lot of money. Oh, it's because those aren't open. Hold on. Shit. There we go. <laughs> Krogan armor. I'm going to open all of these things before we... Uh... Shit. Unleash those like... Oh! <gasps> That's what I'm talking about. Oh, and it looks cool, too. That's bitchin'. Look at that. So we, like, spin her around? No. We'll see her. We'll see her on the field. Yo, right? It's about 15 minutes. Okay. <laughs> see on Friday night. Oh, yeah. You get, you get some rest. It's late where you are. Thank you for popping in and hanging out with us. Appreciate it. Oh no, the thing I've got on her is better than this. Okay. I was gonna say, I was gonna say, if, if, if I spent all those credits just to find everybody better shit here, I was gonna be slightly peeved. That's another uh, Phoenix. That's the same one that I just got for uh, Tali, right? Yeah, that's the exact same one. Okay. Vendor trash, though. Sick. 
See, I don't care about the tech cooldown bonus. I like... The other two are way better. The other two stats are way more useful to me. Okay. 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 This is gonna be something out of a fucking horror movie. This is gonna be bad. This is gonna be bad. Nara's armor accentuates her... Isn't it slick? It is! Yeah, big Star Wars vibes. I agree. She looks really cool. Okay. Where's the third one? Where's the third one? There was no sign of uh, Kahoku among the creeper corpses. He must be at one of the la one of the other labs in the area. Oh, so did we? What Cerberus horrors will find at the next base. I'm right here. On your order, Shepard. But I thought he went into hiding. Did they say? Did did we get? Swept out, revealed another Cerberus operation on this world. Destroy that base as well. I thought he went into hiding, though. Didn't he tell us he went into hiding? Cerberus, remember that company? I'll remember it. I remember stuff. Um, no, but didn't he say he was going to have to, like, go into hiding so they wouldn't find him? I didn't... I don't remember getting any, um... Any confirmation. You obviously do. Because you remember this. Um... Yeah, but I don't recall getting any confirmation at any point that he had been taken by them. I was just under the impression that he went into hiding. But I guess they have him. We're going to get him back. I don't remember any of it in my first playthrough. Well, certain things I'm keeping notes of, especially in this little spreadsheet of mine. Once we were looking through the other, uh, like, planets that we'd been to, I'd rem I remembered names. I was like, oh, yeah, yeah, I remember this. I vaguely remember coming here. Like, I like I liked keeping notes, though, too. When something comes up, like, I remember, like, oh, yeah, I remember that. Oh, oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, okay. We have cover. Back up. All right. This is going swimmingly. Oh, I hear the, uh, I hear the small pecker mobile outside. Things I'm saying to remember are, like, long-term memory stuff, not, like, next mission stuff. Well, yeah, obviously, later in the game. Like little comments about things to remember. BRB Kiddo wants to show me some. Well, you won't, you won't miss much other than, uh, another shootout. But it's fine. We'll win. We're good at that. Oh, you. Go, go, go! Sir. Uh, 
I love when Liara does that shit. <laughs> Liara's just over here using the force and shit. One, two, three, one, two, three. Okay. I think that's Kahoku in there. I'm just gonna double check these things and make sure there aren't any uh, pickups before I open that up. Because those are gonna be annoying to hit. They're small, they are very small targets. Hey, right, fuck it. One last stop to make, Shepard. We owe Kahoku that much. Oh, it is. Aw. You check for a pulse but find none. Admiral Kahoku is dead. Despite the ferocity of the creatures he was sealed in with, there are no signs of trauma on his corpse. The needle marks on his arm suggest a different means of execution. Oh, goddess. It's Admiral Kahoku. Cerberus must have tracked him down. Lead on, Commander. So now, what do they want me to do? Destroy mains. Oh! Yeah, that's complete. And now we have a new side quest. Oh, what did I miss? Um, kiddo got a shiny Vulpix. Nice! Wait, what are you saying? Later in the, uh, later in the game, later in the series. Oh, okay. I have buttons to tell them to do things, right? I just set them to do them themselves. So that brings, uh, her collection of shinies to Rattata, uh, Eevee, Bell, Sprout, and Bolt. Nice! So let's go Eevee, which has significantly higher shiny odds. Yeah. So, gold and silver are good. I haven't played a Poké game since before shinies were a thing. I, um... And I got my sh shorts are, like, stuck to the back of my legs. Um... No, I went into my options and told them to just use their abilities themselves. I gave them free reign. It was set to defensive ones only, and I just set it to all. And ever since I did that, they have been kicking ass. Especially Liara. Liara has some real interesting abilities she's using. You know what? There. Make my res better. Um. Electronics. Your decryption is good where it is right now. Let's. What's up your armor? We got some heavy Krogan armor. Huh. 
Power difficulty is you almost have you almost have to manage your abilities. Um, also to tell them what weapons to use, which can be handy. Of course, we use weapons they're proficient with. Oh yeah, I have that uh, set up on them already. I've 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 told them uh, I've got them uh, with what weapons. Words. So, the main facility is in the other system in this cluster. So that's easy. I wanted to go check that out anyway, since we were in the vicinity. It's been so long since we've done any of the main story. <laughs> we'll get to it after this, hopefully. Hold on. Okay. Main story, fuck the galaxy can save itself for a bit. We're busy. Exactly! We're helping the people. Saren's not going anywhere. Commander, incoming signal from 5th Fleet HQ on the Citadel. Commander Shepard, something uncomfortable has just come up. In the first contact war, we fired a lot of espionage probes into Turian space. We just received a mission complete burst from one of them. Straightforward enough. What makes this uncomfortable? When these probes were launched, we didn't have any idea who we were fighting. We didn't want to risk aliens examining our technology. The probe has a demo nuke built in. Oh! When he killed a ton tactical fusion warhead, about equal to the bomb dropped on Hiroshima back in the 20th. If somebody finds that probe, tampers with it, you don't need me to finish, Commander. That's serious, all right. I understand this must be handled, but I don't have anyone trained to deal with this sort of thing, sir. I know. I wouldn't ask if it wasn't important. These probes have been classified for 26 years. Helping some people. How could it? Yeah. Cold fusion bomb will be traps dangerous and irresponsible. The Alliance would face censure if they find this probe. I'm asking you because the Normandy can get on site quickly and quietly. It's in the Voyager cluster. Where is it? We'll get on it immediately, Admiral. And we'll be discreet. I appreciate that, Commander. Good luck. Out. Well, coming from the Amazon, the head there and track it down. Oh, okay. Well, what planet is this? Nephron is where? Okay. Excuse me. Agabinium. Agabinium is a small terrestrial world with an extremely thin atmosphere of carbon dioxide and krypton. Though the planet is a sufficient mass to maintain a much thicker atmosphere, much of it has been blasted away. The red giant Amazon is a long period variable star. Currently at the um, nadir of a 16 year cycle. At peak, its energy output doubles, lashing ag agabinium with intense heat and radiation. The crust is mainly composed of aluminum with deposits of tin. Much of the surface is coated with fine silicate dust, which easily penetrates giggity, the smallest cracks uh, to foul machinery. Um, that's probably where our nuke is. Um, your nuke is an enormous terrestrial world. Nearly twice the size of Earth. Its environment is similar to that of Mars. Arid and a mix of craggy basalt highlands and sand-scoured deserts of iron-laced silicate dust. Dernuica's atmosphere mainly consists of carbon dioxide and argon, but the planet's mass is great enough that measurable amounts of helium and even molecular hydrogen remain trapped in its atmosphere. The planet's gravity well is deep enough that it's collected nearly a dozen small satellites, most captured uh, mostly captured asteroids. 
Its surface is scarred, uh, many large imp is scarred by many large impact craters. That one was my fault. Marking the final resting place of other captured asteroids. There's no survey, no nothing. Um, Sonat, Sonedma. Sened, Senedma nuts. Senedma is the second of the Amazon system's arid superterrestrial world. It is considerably less dense than its neighbor, Dernueca, uh, and has an uh, atmosphere of carbon dioxide and ethane. Its frozen surface is mainly composed of iron lace silicates with deposits of sulfur. I, oh shit, I didn't survey it. God damn it. Okay. Oh, uh, we got polonium. Cool. Simon. A small rock and ice planet, Simon has an extremely thin atmosphere of hydrogen, sulfide, and ethane. Its frozen surface is mainly composed of magnesium and silicates with deposits of iron. Sybin's crust contains significant deposits of green serpentine, a mineral formed by volcanic activity. This suggests Sybin was more geo a geologically active world in the distant past. Survey. We got a Turian insignia. Nice. Um, Tremar. Tremar is a standard hydrogen helium gas giant with traces of methane and nitrogen in its upper atmosphere. Survey. We found uh, nitrogen. Wait a minute. There's a third system here. Well, well, we're here. Let's go play with a nuke. I just did the, just did the thing again. Trying to figure out what thing you're talking about. I'm trying to remember. Oh, my fucking. And my chest didn't hurt, which just I never had my heart do that. Ha! Huh. Hyper wear my heart for a second. I'll probably just like a flutter. Just like palpitations. That's a symptom of anxiety, actually. Anomaly, Alliance homing beacon. Oh no, oh no. Well. I'm feeling anxious. I mean, I don't have to. Even when I'm not feeling anxious, I randomly have fucking uh, heart palpitations. Yeah, it might just be like from stress. You don't feel weird in any other way, right? Excuse me, goddamn. Um. Yeah, probably just stress. If one of those damn sandworms pops out of here. Is this where the... The signal is coming from a mine? A trap. It has to be. I concur. This did not crash. Someone moved it here. Whoever did is in danger. They may not know what they have. Let's find it before they set it off. All right, Shepard. Yeah, some, like, dumb nuts in here is gonna set off a nuke. We don't want that to happen. Since I was kind of getting worried. And that can make it worse. <laughs> as fucked up as that is. It ends up snowballing. Giggity giggity, I'll snowball you. Blah, blah, blah. Um. It's the argument against intelligence, sir. <laughs> Hello? 
Anybody home? We hear you may have a nuclear bomb. Anybody in here seen a nuclear bomb? Huh? Seen a nuclear bomb laying around anybody? This place is fucking empty. drop a hard save right here? Seismic charge. Someone did that on purpose. Shepard, at last. That scared the shit out of me. Who are you? You have me at a disadvantage. You don't Remember me. <laughs> no matter. I remember you. I never forget anyone I fought. My name is Ilanos Halliot. I doubt you know it. Who do you think runs the Terminus clan, Shepard, huh? Thousands of pirates, slavers, criminals of every stripe. An acclimated leader, or an acclaimed leader. In most criminal organizations, it's the one who's recognized as the most successful. That's correct. The one who kills the most men, seizes the most ships, pillages the most colony. Three years ago, I was the strongest. I used my influence to assemble a similar fleet. We would drive your kind out of the verge. You attacked Elysium. You're the one behind the attack on Elysium. I was the motivator, the instigator, the one who promised glory and riches for sacking the largest human colony in the cluster. The one blamed when it failed, failed, failed because of you, your damnable holding action. We negotiate? It doesn't have to be like this, Halliot. Empty words from a dead man. Goodbye, Shepard. What do we do now, Shepard? No one panic. We've got air and light, and the Normandy's still in orbit. Let's look for another way out. There's no time to get out. You have to disable the bomb before it goes off. Oh, Jesus. You disabled the bomb! Sure. Give me a fun fact. I could so easily just climb over that. Like, a person could just climb through there. Changed him to terrain here. I was wondering, so I googled because I could have sworn he was human. Huh. That kind of makes more sense to make him Turian.
Well, I'm right near some debris. Why did it say... Escape the trap and take down... Uh... Halliot if I can. He... Th there was no trap. There were no people. Mass Mandela effect if you will. Jesus Christ. Waka waka. Um... Threaded that needle. Hell yeah, I did. So we're gonna like we're just gonna find the car. We're gonna get out of here. Oh, we have hostels. He's down. He's down. He's down. What's the shooting at me? Oh.
Every now and then I can actually play it smart. Oh shit. I get ready for bed. Aw. Will you go ahead and get yourself a second full day in a week? I was thinking. That was more uncomfortable. I'm sorry, man. Let's see with how big this game is. I'm glad you're doing two days a week of this. I, yeah, I have to be. And I'm, I'm gonna be go, I'm, I'm gonna be doing like extra long ones. Like, I can't not. I am, I am, there's so much to do and I'm having so much fun. Uh, Halliot went through a lot of trouble to draw you here. A pity it ended like this, for him at least. Now that you're above ground, your suit radio has reestablished connection with the Normandy. Time to get the hell out of here. Like, you gotta admit, that was the smartest way I could have played that. Like, as high up as I was and as much cover as I had, that was easily, that was the smart play. Which makes me want to get uh, some points in sniper rifles. Because that might be a good plan if some shit like that ever comes up again. Dragon Age because they're a Mass Effect reference. So get nice. So we took care of the nuke. Um, and then there's engine debris, Alliance homing beacon. And there's that anomaly right there. It's funny, they like stole the car. I guess that would have prevented you from going back, finding the car and just bringing it around and using the turret. Like I can see why they did it that way. Like, so you'd actually have to, you know, like, play the video game? I respect it. I respect it. Oh. Torian Insignia. How are we on our collections? We only need two more Prothean artifacts. We need six more Turian emblems. Um, we need ten more Asari writings. We... We're way over on gases. We need a lot of other minerals and shit, though. Whatever. Whatever. Now we go destroy.
It's gonna look weird, I'm sorry. I have to grab my mouse because I have to do something on the other uh, monitor. There we go. Um, I think she got to go to the washroom and her depends or something. Oh man. The noises in my backside. God damn it. Depends if he refuses to. Oh no. It's got to admit, like, when you need that, you know? There's no shame in it. Um. We're gonna come back and do a more thorough comb of there as well. Tomorrow. When we're just, uh, you know, having our thirsty Thursday time. an asteroid belt. Really? Nothing in either of the asteroid belt? Nothing in either of the asteroid belts? Logia is a hothouse terrestrial world with a dense atmosphere of nitrogen and sulfur dioxide. The surface is scorching hot and mainly composed of iron with deposits of gold. The core of Clogia is very hot and tectonically active. Volcanic eruptions are common and outgassing continues to add to the density of the atmosphere. The largest active volcano has a caldera nearly 100 kilometers in diameter. And its basalt floods have covered an area roughly the size of the Earth continent of Australia. Nephiron. I think this is where we need to go, yeah. So we'll read that when we go down there. Ontoheater. I barely know her. Um, Ontoheater is an unusually large uh, ice world with a core of silicate rock and light metals. And a trace atmosphere of quick kind of xenon. Uh, the crust is mainly composed of water ice. Ontoheater's ice sheets uh, show obvious signs of large-scale fracture and refreezing centered on a massive crater near the South Pole. A recent extranet meme suggests that a Prothean ship crashed through the crust of the planet before the collapse of, the, uh, of their empire and might still be recovered from the planetary core. This is purportedly the source of the planet's unusually high mass. Careful mapping of Ontoheater's gravity field by orbiting satellites have proved that the planetary core is entirely normal. Survey. Rare element. We found Samarium. Uh, Gromar is a rocky terrestrial world with a trace atmosphere of krypton and xenon. The frozen surface is mainly composed of copper with deposits of calcium. I used to go into his bedroom because that's where the bathroom he uses is in carpet. Oh, no. They can fill every star system. What's an Auntin? Why does it need a heater? It is an ice planet, yeah. Prior to the Alliance's expansion into the Voyager Cluster, Gromar hosted one half of a Turian uh, interfer in, in, inter interferometric uh, telescope array, connected with a similar telescope in the uh, Attican Beta Cluster by an expensive chain of FTL comm buoys. The two function as a single virtual lens with an effective aperture equal to the thousands of light years between them. The Turians use this to chart the Terminus systems with great accuracy. Survey. We got a medallion! We found a League of One medallion! Alright, let's go to the place we have to go. 
Nephron is a barren volcanic terrestrial world with an atmosphere of carbon dioxide and krypton. Its surface is mainly composed of sodium with deposits of magnesium. Aside from displays of geological beauty, including many spectacular volcanoes, this barren world is of little interest. Entries uh, relating to Nephron in the astronomical, data astronomical database are sparse. We're gonna land on it! No, I won't grow more. Already fully grown. <laughs> Said we got a medallion. I heard we got an alien. No, we got a medallion. Let's bring our ladies with us. Taco shot. Well... Shot, talk, shot. I met inspired. Yes, obviously. Okay, but well, we've got a mineral deposit right up here we can grab. We'll go straight to the actual map markers. After we get this. And I've added this planet to the list of ones for us to actually give a full combing through. What do you mean I can't scale literally vertically? Come on. I'm a goat, motherfucker. Okay. We got thorium. Okay. Anomaly, underground facility, and debris. We'll get this debris on our way out. Let's go to this anomaly first. Anomaly, anomaly. Anomaly. Incubus song. Um. Mike has forsaken his identity as a mole and he's now a goat. Oh god. Mike forsakes all of his. I was never a fish. That was propaganda. That was gay fish propaganda. There was even a shirt about it. Propaganda. It's not real. You are fake news. You are, you fake, are, fake, are fake, fake, fake news. news. You are fake news. Actually, that's another button I have that you guys don't. <laughs> that's for me to use against you guys when you uh, hit me with the uh, propaganda. This Cerberus soldier had an identification tag for Captain Varsynth, one of the Salarian soldiers responsible for capturing the League of One. It's unclear how he came into possession of this relic. Alright. 
There are hostiles. I don't see any turrets. So, uh... I think they're fucked. You see that guy? Fuck that guy. Hey, 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 hey. Fuck you. Hey, hey, fuck you. <laughs> oh, I got some hang time on that one. All right. From the... It was flickering and it was bothering me. Fucking wreck your place. Fucking doing donuts in your front yard, motherfuckers. This is what you get for killing, uh, uh, Kohaku. beautiful redeem. It was, it was great. I'll have to, I'll have to timestamp that one. Um, add the yeet when you hit the guy for TikTok. <clears throat> Excuse me. Excuse me? Sir! You two take care of that side. I'll take care of this side. Here it comes. Right in his face. Oh, Jesus. Uh, well, well, hello again, Liara. Sir, we just want to talk. Come on.
bitch. Um. Anywho, I did get an achievement. I'll have to check what all these what all these chivos are. I don't think I can see them from here yet. Yeah, no. We've cleared this room, so let's save that. See if there's any loot in here. All right. No loot. No loot. Anyway, I love you, bitch. I know you're gonna stop loving you, bitch. Content. Eat the fuck out of your shields. Yeah, they were hitting me with something that was like wrecking my shields. Just want to talk about your car's extended warranty. It's null and void on account of your death, bitch. Bitch. Fuck yeah. Yep. That's the same as the one that uh, she's got. So, uh, at least I can sell the dupes. What up, Ariel? How are you doing? Can a light bulb woman understand things that make me feel smart? Like what? What? What is it? You know, especially with a hard be a bitch. You cautiously press a few buttons and an alarm chimes. The optical database is flashing itself. Quickly, you copy as many files as you can to your hard suit's internal computer. It's memory wiped, the computer shuts down. The files are sure to be encrypted, but you've got time to crack them. Oh, well. Fitness, fitness, dick. Um, no, I want, I want to give you another point in lift. Give you a point in your damping thing. Um, That's it. 
All we have are our regular collection quests. We can do some main story. I'm gonna black bear sighted in my area. Black bear, better than a mountain lion. Oh shit. It's weird because like we have three trees every 10 miles. We get cougars around here a lot actually. Black bears tend to follow humans because they know they can get food. Yeah. Happy I got things figured out because holy shit, today was a lot of work. I need to get done and shipped away at a time. Also, probably have more trees than humans, you know. What What was your big light bulb moment, Ariel? What What kind of thing did you figure out? Yo, yo, boo boo. Hey, boo boo. We gotta get this big and egg basket. Council has received reports of Geth interest in the corporate research colony of Novaria. The council needs to know why. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Transmission coming uh, in, Commander. I think you're going to want to hear this one. Greetings, Commander Shepard. I represent a party interested in obtaining information on Cerberus activities. What's your name? Who are you and who do you represent? Who I am is inconsequential. Suffice to say, I am an agent for the Shadow Broker. Oh, fuck that. You see, Admiral Kahoku contacted my employer looking for information on the location of any Cerberus facilities. We provided that information on the promise that he would turn over copies of all files gathered from the Cerberus systems to us. <laughs> Did you have anything to do with Admiral Kahoku ending up dead? We had no reason to harm him. He was going to provide us with information about Cerberus. Information that is now in your possession. You must have some connection to Cerberus. How else could you tell Kahoku where to find them? Information is our business, Commander. Through our contacts, we were able to determine that the Cerberus group was active in the Voyager cluster. Unfortunately, that was all we were able to find out. That is why we are so interested in acquiring copies of the files from you. That's treason. These are classified Alliance files. I'm not handing them over to you. Be reasonable, Commander. Cerberus was operating outside Alliance jurisdiction. You don't owe them any loyalty. The Alliance is just going to file this information away in some archive. No secret stays hidden forever. Eventually, someone somewhere will deliver it into our hands. Might as well be you. Transmit the files to us and you will be well compensated. Why do you want the files? What are you going to do with this information? The information is a commodity. It can be bought, sold, or traded. Why my employer desires this information is not my concern. I am only the buyer. I don't trust you. My loyalty is to the Alliance, not the Shadow Broker. That is unfortunate, Commander. My employer will remember this the next time you need something. Payday? Payday! No! I don't trust the Shadow Broker. I don't like the Shadow Broker. Shadow Broker can suck my nuts. I would have found Tally. She was kind of causing a ruckus. I forgot to check that debris. Get the kiddo ready for bed. I'm just gonna go get this debris.
How Paragon am I? I'm decently Paragon. Level 29 already, and we've barely touched the main story. <laughs> oh yeah, Ariel, are you uh, marking your bingo card? Because there's still one bingo left. Now we can get up on the ship. I'm actually going to do a quick DJ Pikachu break. Because it's been a bit since I've been up. Um... And I'll be right back. Potatoes! Subscribe to 171st Street Games. You can enjoy ad-free viewing, along with an assortment of fun emotes and a set of exclusive subscriber-only video commands in chat. Show your support and subscribe today.
potatoes. So do I. Um, okay. I didn't know very to investigate uh, on the... Okay. Well, let's go. Let's do it! the horse head nebula. Uh, Svalrog is a small but typical hydrogen and helium gas giant whose orbit lies quite close to the star. It's a giga for a star with a close orbiting gas giant to have a habitable world. Savarag is, is Pax's only gas giant, but its temperature, powerful winds, and high orbital velocity make it a poor candidate for helium-3 mining. While Navaria enjoys plentiful uh, deuterium for its fusion plants, it imports all its helium-3 from out system. Morana. Morana is an icy planetoid smaller than Earth's moon. Many planetary geologists suspect it was once an Oort cloud ice dwarf which migrated inward after an encounter with some other body. Don't we know about space right now? I wonder what the planet lore would look like. It, right? While the crust is frozen water ice, deeper layers are mostly silicates with pockets of magnesium and aluminum. Morana is tidally locked to Pax. The same side always faces the sun. Oh, is this like itchy? Velus has a thin atmosphere of xenon and krypton. Most other materials have frozen and fallen as snow. Its surface is composed of potassium with deposits of magnesium. While investigating the primitive anaerobic life of Velus, Do you binary... have to burn but think cheering is too mundane? We have a wide variety of sound alerts and stream stickers from which you can select to interact with the stream in fun ways. Go ahead and give them a try. Binary Helix survey teams discovered a cunningly hidden anchorage of the ancient Krogan warlord Moro. Many records and artifacts of the Krogan Rebellions were recovered and sold at auction. The empty base is now abandoned. Itchy nose, itchy nose. Matriarch's writings! Cool. Novaria is a small frozen terrestrial world barely habitable by convention by conventional definitions. It is privately chartered by the Novaria Development Corporation, whose lease whose who lease out labs to perform research too dangerous or controversial to be performed elsewhere. Given Novaria's unique situation, it is the source of many wild conspiracy theories. Well, let's land there and see what happens. Now is this one gonna be another hallway? Because this is an actual main story place. Approach control, this is the SSV Normandy, requesting a vector and a berth. Normandy, arrival was not scheduled. Our defense grid is armed and tracking you. State your business. Citadel business. We got a council specter aboard. Landing access granted, Normandy. Be advised, we will be confirming identification on arrival. If confirmation cannot be established, your vessel will be impounded. You can try! What a fun bunch. I think I'll take my next leave here. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck.
That's far enough. We'll cooperate. Not here to cause problems. This is an unscheduled arrival. I need your credentials. Who are you? You first. We're the law here. Show some respect. I'm Captain Maiko Matsuo, Elanis Risk Control Services. I'm with the Council. I'm a Spectre. My name is Shepard. Load of horse crap, man. We will need to confirm that. Also, I must advise you that firearms are not permitted on Novaria. Sergeant Sterling, secure their weapons. It would not be wise to search for the Geth unarmed. Easy, people. Let's not start a fight. I'll be behind you. That armor's in good condition. Captain Matsuo, stand down. We confirmed their identity. Spectres are authorized to carry weapons here, Captain. You may proceed, Spectre. I hope the rest of your visit will be less confrontational. I do too! We'll meet you upstairs. Behave yourself. Yeah! Better calm the fuck down! Get out of here. Go fuck yourself. I'm sure Parasi-san will answer any questions you have. Alright, you weeb. Can't open that. We're very limited as to where we can go. Let's see you next Tuesday, right? I am Gianna Parasini, assistant to Administrator Analeas. We apologize for the incident in the docking bay. Thanks for getting us through. I appreciate your help. You're welcome. You understand our security chief was only doing her job. One of my duties is orientation of new arrivals. Do you have any questions? I heard there were Geth here. Has anyone unusual passed through here recently? Unusual? And a sorry matriarch passed through a few days ago. Lady Benezia. Oh, shit! Benezia. She is here. I need to talk to her. Can I speak with her? Benezia left for the Peak 15 research complex days ago. To the best of my knowledge, she's still there. I'll need directions. Could you tell me how to get there? You'll need to ask Administrator Analeas for clearance to leave this port. Where's Analeas? Where can I find the Administrator? His office is on the main level, left at the top of the elevator. Why so many guards? Pretty heavy security for such a small port. The executive board does everything in its power to protect the privacy of our client corporations. I'm not here for them. I'm not here to dig out any corporate secret. That's gratifying to hear. Understood. Can we go in now? Of course. If you need any help, you can ask me at the administrator's office. She is here. I can't believe it. I imagine you want to talk to me, Shepard. About my mother. Don't worry. No, I don't. I trust you, Leo. You may not be military, but you're part of my crew. Thank you, Shepard. That means a great deal to me. Welcome to Port Hanshin, the galaxy's most respected site for independent scientific research and development. For your own safety, and to protect the privacy of others, you are required to obey any directions given by our security personnel. They can try! If you have questions or concerns, our friendly administrative staff is always available. Thank you, and enjoy your stay. Well, there's a shop right here. This one offers greetings. You are the specter that visits Port Hanchan. Shasta? Ooh, I like Shasta. Sure, whatever. This is a store, right? Of course. This one apologizes for inconveniencing you. This one offers greetings. You are sure, whatever. Of course. 
This one apologizes for inconvenience. Oh no. Oh no, I don't like the sh the drop in shields. There's so much rice. Did it come out good? I'd like to speak to Analeas. One moment, please. Mr. Analeas? Yes, what, what? Commander Shepard is asking to see you, sir. That's what's wrong. Right, fine, come in. You will excuse me if I don't stand. I have no time to entertain colonial rubes. You're in my file. I see you looked up my service record. Only a fool enters negotiation without knowledge of the other party's tendencies. This greeting is a courtesy. I will only cooperate as required by the executive board. Businesses come here to avoid the second guessing of galactic law. Lack of oversight risky? Are you telling me you have no safety protocols? Don't be ridiculous. Do you think a for-profit company would take no precautions against loss of life and material? Project yeah, Lead have the final say here, not meddlesome politicians. Do you do business with Saren? Agent Saren? One of your Spectre compatriots? He is a major investor in Binary Helix Corporation, which is one of Novaria's backers. Is Binary Helix developing weapons for him? It's possible, given his interests. What our clients do in their labs is their business. I've heard an Asari matriarch is here. Venezia? She arrived a few days ago, accompanied by a personal escort and some cargo. She's up at peak 15. What sort of cargo? What can you tell me about her cargo? Large, heavy, and sealed. It passed weapon screening. Beyond that, it is not our concern. What do you mean, personal escort? The phrase is self-explanatory. Bodyguards attending to the safety of her person, mainly Asari commandos. Commandos? Odd that you shouldn't mind their presence. They followed all our regulations. I had no reason to forbid Lady Benezia from taking them. I'd like to see her, immediately. I'm afraid that you cannot. Peak 15 is a private facility in the Scotty Mountains. Regardless, there is a blizzard in the area. Shuttles are grounded and surface access has been cut off. What brought her out here? If I knew, I wouldn't be at liberty to say. She came here as Agent Saren's executor. She is here on business for Binary Helix. There were issues at Peak 15 that required Saren's attention. Back to my other questions. Every minute of my time you waste costs the company 12 credits. I will keep a running tally. I have no more questions at this time. Good. I received a dozen urgent messages while you did it about. Mr. Analyst. The races so they can be understood, otherwise they speak insane. You've never worked in the corporate world, have you, Commander? You can't bludgeon sure. through bureaucracy. I can see that. So it would seem. I need an alternative. Talk to Lorik Keen. You should be able to find him at the hotel bar. Can't say more. Not with an earshot of Mr. Analeas. How large are the facilities here? We have 17 research complexes built into the mountains. Each is a self-sufficient facility housing a staff of hundreds. So good. You said I should talk to Lorik Keen? Mr. Analeas isn't the only one with a pass to leave Hanshan. Keen spends his days at the hotel since his office was closed. Tell me about the companies that work on Novaria. 
Over 250 high-tech firms rent our labs. Major shareholders include Elanis Risk Control Services, Binary Helix, and Synthetic Insights Limited. Your guards work for ERCS, don't they? The executive board gets a discount on facility security. Elanis also develops lethal and non-lethal weapons. Binary Helix. They work in genetics? BH is a leader in genetics and biotechnology. They try to keep a low profile in the media. Much of their research is in biotic modifications. That angers many Luddite, organic baseline, and fundamentalist groups. Haven't I seen synthetic insights in the news lately? They're one of only four corporations licensed by the Citadel Council to develop artificial intelligence. They attract many protests. No agitators have ever breached our security. That's why they invest heavily here. Adjusting my fan. It wasn't quite aimed at me. I've taken up enough of your time. Not at all, Spectre. This is my job, after all. All right, let's go find this fucker. Gotta be up one of these two elevators. I like the pattern uh, on her new armor. Excuse me, I need a moment of your time. The male human at the hotel bar, he's a sales rep for Binary Helix. His name is Raphael Vargas. I need you to speak with him. Do you know who I am? Everyone here knows who you are, Dullstone. That makes you ideal for my job. You are a known quantity, or so Vargas will think. He will assume you are here to investigate his company's dirty laundry. That will distract him from your, my, real intentions. He's right there. Why not talk to him yourself? I wish I could. I already bungled this myself. He realized I was not a real buyer. I don't know anything about binary healings. What would I talk to Vargas about? I represent the Aramali City Council on Thessia. Our town is known for its biotic amp crafters. What is your city's interest in binary helix? They do not manufacture amps. <laughs> Much of BH's work relates to biotics. There are rumors that the Novaria branch has flown in Asari right. biotics. Powerful ones. Commandos, to be specific. We want to assess any potential risk to Asari copyrights. You will present yourself as a buyer, on behalf of the Spectres or the Alliance. Discuss their military enhancement programs. Your real objective will be to distract him. I will give you a device that will crack into his personal wireless network. It will upload a variety of monitoring viruses. They will infiltrate Binary Helix when he logs onto their intranet. What's in it for me? Money, of course. I would be well paid for this. So would you. 500 credits. Interesting plan. I'm in. Excellent. Here is the cracking device. You will know it is done when it beeps. I have assembled a dossier on Vargas. If you would like, I could brief you on his behavior patterns. Tell me what you know about Vargas. 
He is impatient with those who waste his time. Right. I tried to get him distracted ah, and off topic. Fine. He concluded I was not interested in his company's services. I noticed he has a tell. When a topic makes him nervous or uncomfortable, he has a tendency to rub the back of his neck. If you see that, press him on the subject. It may distract him enough to keep him talking. I'll go see him now. I hope to hear very soon. Oh, look at what I've got myself into now. Can I help you? Mr. Vargas, I'm Commander Shepard, the Spectre. I understand you work for Binary Helix. That's correct. Rafael Vargas, sales. Were you interested in our services? I might be. That depends on what sort of offer your company can make. It was my understanding that the Citadel contracted to a Solarian Corporation for its enhancement programs. I'm sure you know that we pass a new budget every fiscal year. If it delivers a better soldier, contracts can change. A sound business practice. Excuse my hesitation, I've never heard a government accused of good business sense. First, the boilerplate disclaimer. No genetic enhancement is guaranteed to take. We can maximize the odds, but every strand of DNA is unique. Our patented techniques can provide 1% improvement in adrenal response, 12% faster clotting, and a measurable decrease in CG muscle degeneracy. Muscle degeneracy? I've never heard of a technique that improves zero gravity endurance. It's a first for the industry. The advent of element zero-based artificial gravity made it a less pressing concern. We're still waiting for tests to give us an average improvement. We estimate a 7 to 11 percent decrease in muscle loss rates. I can get you those improvements for 30k credits per head. Oh! For the full quarter, I can work in a sensory enhancement package. Guaranteed 2015 vision and hearing from 12 to 22,000 hertz. What about distribution? How would you distribute the upgrades? Retroviral injections would take some time. Well, it does take time to upgrade a body with adjusted DNA. Skin cells could be replaced in two weeks, but the liver takes over a year, the skeleton a decade. For frontline units, we can speed the process with full system transfusions and injections to stimulate regrowth. It would still take six months to see results. I have to admit, it surprised me that you were here for business. There are many development projects on Ovaria, some not entirely. I wear a lot of hats, Mr. Vargas. Some days I shut down criminals, some days I defuse nukes, some days I like to enjoy private vices. You understand me? I suppose. My apologies. Your manner is rather informal for a business meeting. I'm sorry, Mr. Vargas. That's a call I have to take. Thank you for your time. Of course, Commander Shepard. Any results? Your toy did its job. Excellent. I will transfer 500 credits to your account. Only 500? All right. I thought you might have wanted to provide more, since you couldn't do it yourself, I mean. Did I say 500 credits? I meant 750. Good day, Spectre. Got the Riz! Oh, that gave me Renegade points! Oh no. I have the tiniest sliver of Renegade. Oh yeah! Now that I'm actually advancing the plot. Afternoon. Sit down, have a drink. What can I do for you? Are you Loric Keen? I've heard you might be able to help me. You are the Spectre that just arrived, are you not? What can old Turian like me possibly help you with? I'm trying to find a way into the garage. I have places to go. You need a pass. How fortuitous. 
I'm the manager of the local Synthetic Insights office, for the moment at least. Mr. Analeas closed my office. He claims to be investigating reports of my corruption. The administrator is an interesting man. He's become quite wealthy since he took direct control of rents. I sense a connection there. Indeed. I acquired evidence of Analeas' actions. His hired goons are ransacking my office to find it. Oh! I suspect your goal lies outside this port. Mr. Analeas would be disinclined to let you wander. They do you look cool. the evidence from my office, I will give you my garage pass, as well as a sum of credits. Why didn't Analeas cancel your pass clearance? Why should he? There's nothing outside but snow and hungry napak. How did you get a pass? I'm a manager. Most executives on Novaria are free to come and go as they will. You have a plan? I do. However, there is one other... What is that charming human expression? Fly in the lotion? Violence against Mr. Analeas' thugs may be necessary. He has members of Han Shan's security team searching my offices. He's paying them under the table. Miss Matsuo is unaware of their outside employment. I'll focus on trying to get your evidence. If I'm lucky, I won't have to fight anyone. Excellent. Here is my pass into our offices. It will activate the elevator. The evidence is on my office computer. This OSD contains an encryption key to access it. Right. Slide it into the drive and it will auto-execute. Oh, and do try to keep blood stains off the carpets, would you? That I can't promise. What sort of a... Good. I don't think I'm supposed to mention numbers. They'd only write them down on things for it. Full benefits, of course. Oh, I'm sure. The company takes care of its own. But we sign for vacations. So that's how they have their year and start getting the contracts. You hear about the resort? And the equation. It's a weird little room. Tracking, diving, an accredited asset you were afield. Sorry, the hotel is off limits to those without a corporate account. Oh, bite me! There we'll complete whatever this is, and then I'll call it for the night. We'll raid out. It'll be a while, though, because we still got to go to that fucking... We still got to go to the place outside of here in the mountains. You got to get me over that mountain! Spectre, right? Yes. Yeah, that's me. I used to be a military tech. Except for my arrows people, everyone's too corporate here. They just sit around sipping expensive water. What can I do for you today? You seem like you have an ear to the ground. What's happening around here? There's the problems up on Peak 15. Synthetics Insights were shut down by Analeas. And a matriarch came. I know all of that already. How can I get into the garage? You need a pass. You can get one from Analeas for the managers. If you can polish enough gizzard. Maybe you could let me borrow yours? Sure. If I wanted to lose my job and get sued into the next spiral arm. Security tracks card use. I have to go. You need anything? I'll be here. What a friendly guy. We gotta go to the Candy Mountain, Charlie! It's a magical Leoplorodon.
Freeze! Henshan security. This office is sealed. What are you doing in these offices? The administrator's orders. Laura Keen is under investigation. Analeas is paying you to shake this place down. Does Captain Matsuo know you're here? Hey, I'm not the one who wants Keen. Analeas has a Varen up his ass about this guy. How about this? You pretend you didn't see us, we'll pretend we didn't see you. I'm gonna have to fight some people. Jesus! Jesus, Liara! Oh, Jesus. Excuse me, moi. Oh, Jesus. Oh, because I'm so over leveled, I'm just fucking rinsing them. Because we've spent so much time doing side quests, I just wash these guys. Download the evidence from Lorik's computer. Uh-oh. I don't think you're supposed to be in here, Shepard. You have me at a disadvantage, miss. Oh. Now you're going to show some respect? I'm Sergeant Kyra Sterling, Ilanis Risk Control Services. Analeas would throw you off world for what you did here. I won't. You know what we did to cop killers on my world? You're here off duty breaking the law for bribe money. You expect us to feel bad for stopping you? I didn't want to fight them. They fired first. Well, I don't need a gun to rip you to pieces. Just glacked her in the dome. There's only... Oh, there's two. Oh, dear.
because it's fun. Whee! Missing person report. To the attention of Administrator Annalise, a man named Gareth is looking for information on the whereabouts of one of our freighters. He believes his brother's ship may have been attacked by privateers while traveling through the Stranish system. Investigation pending. Well, there's a side quest for us. Bye bye, Cyan. Fuck you. From all I've heard, blizzards are quite common here. Do not be fooled by these civilized surroundings. This is a place of secrets and lies. Yes. Yes, it is. We have discovered that. Thank you, Liara. Okay, we're good. What request would you like as a sound command? Commander, there have been reports of noise from the Synthetic Insights Office. Would you know anything about it? Probably Analeas' thugs ripping the place apart. Smart ass, huh? That's fine. I can work with that. Meet me at the hotel for a drink before you talk to Keen. I'll be waiting. Like that smart ass, huh? I can work with that. They fired first, homie. Allow me to reintroduce myself. Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. Why are you here? Why is an internal affairs agent here? The executive board knows about Analeas' corruption. I've been undercover for six months. I want you to convince Keen to testify before the board. With his evidence, this planet can run profitably again. You work for Analeas. Can't you just take his records? <laughs> He's a crook, not a moron. He doesn't keep logs on his computer saying, this month I stole three million credits. Keen's testimony and records are everything I need to prove Analeas' guilt in one package. I like her now that she's dropped the pretense. I thought corruption was the rule on Novaria. 
The rule is don't rock the boat. Self-interest is tolerated if it doesn't interfere with business. Analeas is driving customers away. I need Keen's garage pass to complete my mission. You help my investigation, I'll provide whatever you need. Favor for a favor. In the long run, it is better to remove the source of the problem. Look, Shepard, I don't like this either. You specters play fast and loose with the law. That's bad for business. I'll help you. All right, I'll talk to Keen and see if I can convince him. Thank you. You know where I work. Come talk to me once you know if he'll play ball. Amadeus, Amadeus. Oh, 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 Amadeus! Come be right back, Amadeus! Always a pleasure, Spectre. Any news on that matter I asked you to look into? I finished the job, but an internal affairs investigator contacted me. She wants you to testify against Analeas. Now that you have my property, you want to dictate how I use it. I have no interest in a public spectacle. You'd be a hero. Everyone on this station is chafing under Analeas' extortion. You might end up a hero. My employers rely on the goodwill of the executive board to work here. Excuse me. The board was already investigating Analeas. They're concerned about the worm and their own fruit. All right. It is obvious that I cannot dissuade you. Very well. I will testify. Make whatever arrangements you need with your contact. I will wait here. That gave me a lot of Paragon. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Doctor Zayas, Doctor Zayas. Oh, 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 Doctor Zayas. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, All right. Shaving? Oh, don't shave. Why are you shaving? Can I play the piano anymore? Of course you can. Well, I couldn't before. Everyone was shaping. I'm shapeless. Oh. It's been getting, uh... It's been getting pretty hot around here lately. I, um... I don't enjoy the shaping. Have you given any more consideration to my offer? It took some persuasion, but Keen has agreed to testify. <sighs> That's a world of stress off my back. I'll take the evidence for safe transport. <laughs> I didn't think you'd help me, being a specter and all. I guess some of you can be all right. Doesn't this help you? You don't seem particularly happy. I'm ecstatic, but right now, I just feel like a long day of work is ending. While you were working on Keen, I got you a garage pass. Be careful up there. I have an arrest to make. Wish I had time to change into something easy to move in. I hate skirts. This is an outrage. I'll see that you never work in this sector again. Yeah, yeah, get a move on. You, Shepard! I demand you place this bitch under arrest! You have the right to remain silent. I wish to God you'd exercise it. <laughs> see you around the galaxy, Commander. I owe you a beer. I like her. I'll take her up on that. Right? The little bitchy smirk I had. The little cunty little smirk I was wearing. I'm gonna go. Oh no, we're just. It's just getting started. We're gonna. We're gonna get up in the one tens by this time next month.
Boys! That is a good thing. You're gonna need them. We get really hot here in the summer. Access to the garage is restricted. I have authorization. Excuse me. Yes, that's genuine. Drive safely. The weather's supposed to be pretty bad out in the Olympus Valley. Oh no, not more of these things. Commander. I defeated a Geth ambush. The Geth ambushed us? We fought back. That's it. Geth, you expect me to... Where did they come from? If I were to guess, the Matriarch packed them in the shipping container she arrived with. I don't believe that. We did thorough scans of those. There were no power sources, no element zero masses. If Benezia Sama's containers were packed with these things, there are many more out there. How many more? I need numbers, Captain. A dozen? A hundred? Dozens, at least. They're machines. You could pack them tightly. I must report to the Executive Board. If word gets out about loose geth, there may be an investor panic. Hey, hey, come and rock me on the deus. Her eyes, goddamn right. The one, the one chick outside of the door. Yeah, she's like, God, that hurt. fuck, that hurt. That hurt to even try and impersonate it. Hey, Ariel, Ariel, if you can hear me, what's for dinner tonight, Ariel? What'd you, ha what'd you have? Here we go. I'm good. That was just, that was kind of, okay. So this one, this, it's another hallway. Okay. Oh, we leveled up. Okay, yeah, this one's like a stage. I have a feeling the ones tied to the main quest line are gonna be. Like, the, the only ones that I'm gonna, like, actually really be exploring around on are, like, the optional ones with, like, side quests and shit. The hell the dog is barking is- oh, no. Let's drop a hard save here. Because we just did a lot.
I knew there was probably some shit to pick up around this. So good. There's something over there. It's like showing his hostile. Well, I've got hostiles in here. Shields a little bit of time to uh, recover. Oh, shit. Oh, is it another one of these fucking things? Oh, it's just a little guy. It's just a little guy. Sir. Here I go killing again. Okay, let me drop a hard save here. Okay. Time for murder. Murder. That's the case that they gave me. Hello? Sir. Sir.
There's like a turret or something. There's a big guy up here. It's a turret. I see it. much of this part. I've been pretty fortunate so far, but I think it's because I'm overleveled as fuck. I'm what? Level 31 now. And like, we're like, just like a toe in the shallow end of the main story. And I'm already over half max level. Tomorrow at least, if we get one more level for our girls, tomorrow we will be able to double back to all of those ones that I've marked down, electronics too low and decryption too low, and be able to fucking grab them. We won't have that problem anymore. Because I've almost got their electronics and decryption maxed out. So tomorrow, once I start putting the thirsty in Thursday, we'll run around and do that shit. We'll just have some fucking hangout time while I while I get my drank on. Oh shit, really? I can hear it firing off at me. It's across the canyon. Can I see where it's firing from? Gotcha, bitch. There's another one up around the bend over here. Okay. I love this game. Like, this game is, like, right up my alley. This is, like, an action shooter I can really fucking play. Like, I am loving this. Oh. We're almost to the end of the driving portion of the stage. Soon it'll be fucking slobber knocker time. I see you. And then there's some little guys. Where are the little guys? I see him on my radar. Little 
little guys. Oh, they're inside. Now, it seemed like around over there would be somewhere where they would hide some pickups. Oh. They've rolled out the red carpet for me. Baby, baby. Oh, oh. Just... Thank you, Liara. Excuse my ass? How's this bitch still alive? facilities have suffered a great deal of damage. Biohazard materials present throughout facility. Virtual intelligence user interface offline. Where is Tally? Tally? What are you doing? You missed all the fun! Is this a glitch? The appeal of window wear seems very quickly. Can I open? I can't open this. Well, it looks like it's just me and Liara. That's fine. Liara and I took care of this room. I'm so over leveled, it doesn't really matter.
They want to keep their people in as much as they want to keep others out. Okay, they, they ended up spawning her near me. I was wondering if they were just going to end up doing that. I was like, the game's probably just going to spawn her near me. Excuse me. Oh, it's a sound for every time she goes out, right? Like she was kind of coming towards me and then she'd back off and go fuck around the corner. Sir. Sir, can you not? <laughs> what was that? Animals? Wind? This place is in bad shape. It's because of Liara's, like, biotic abilities I let her start using whenever she wants. She's, like, using the force on him. Excuse me. Oh, I'm so over level. He's never saw her ability. Yeah, because I had it set. Remember when I first started and I was like, what is this thing like off defense or all? And I just set it up for defense. Apparently, that was me telling them that they could use their defensive moves all they wanted. But if I wanted them to use their offensive moves, I had to tell them manually to do it. If you set it for all, they'll just use any of their abilities as they see fit. And it has been producing dividends like crazy. Liara just makes things float and throws them around rooms. Mmm. That's worth it for that slight drop in biotics. Oh, our tech biotic. Oh, that looks neat. Oh, we leveled up again. Jesus Christ! And that it is. Decryption and electronics maxed out for each of them. And now I can work on there because she's got a few in electronics too. 
She doesn't have decryption, but that's fine. Neither do I. I can't really judge her for it. Usually I had Caden and Garrus with me. I'm really enjoying these two. Because I like that it makes my party perfectly balanced. Because I'm all combat. And they're all tech and all biotic. So it gives me a perfectly evened uh, party balance. We're fucking Sudoku bugs. A backup power system, Shepard. Must be for the station main critical startup error. Virtual intelligence user interface offline. Manual boot required. I'll give you a manual boot in a second. DOS boot, right? Oh. The VI core appears inoperable. You can attempt to manually reconfigure the databanks or use Omni gel to repair the damaged systems. Attempt manual reactivation. Transfer module stacks. It took me a second to remember how to do that puzzle. It looks like you're trying to restore this facility. Would you like help? You're the station VI? You're the virtual intelligence that runs this place? This system is monitored to respond to the name Mira. May I ask your name? Commander Shepard. I work for the Citadel Special Tactics and Reconnaissance. One moment, please. Council authority confirmed. You are entitled to secure access of all systems. Booyah! Please note that queries relating to corporate secrets require privileged access. Privileged access is only available to Binary Helix executives. This system is ready to process queries. You may access me at any holographic interface within Peak 15. Where's Benezia? I need to find Matriarch Benezia. Lady Benezia departed on the passenger tramway to the Rift Station subsidiary labs. User alert. The tramway system is currently inoperable. Give me a damage report. What's the situation here? One moment, please. 
Diagnostics in progress. Critical failure. Main reactor shutdown in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Critical failure. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger tram systems are offline. Report complete. Do you have an additional system status query? Do you know why the reactor was shut down? I'm sorry, but I was offline at the time. Shutdown could occur if reactor breach seems likely or in the case of catastrophic laboratory containment failure. Emergency guidelines suggest the frigid environment will kill biological contagions. It may also damage mechanical ones. Turn off the heat and hope the cold puts whatever you've unleashed to sleep. Nice. What do I need to do to get the power back on? The valves to the Helium-3 fuel line must be opened. This can be done at the controls on the reactor assembly proper. What are the landlines, and why are they disabled? The landlines connect my mainframes here at Central Station to the various sub-facilities of Peak 15. This allows the crew to remotely access my databases from the comfort and security of their labs. When emergency protocols were implemented within the hot labs, the cabling was automatically ejected. Tell me what happened here. I'm sorry, but I need a more specific query. Tell me what occurred immediately before you shut down. Stage 1 alert issued at Hot Labs. Contaminants released from Laboratory Pod Gamma. Emergency protocols implemented. Stage 2 alert issued at Hot Labs. Isolation to Tomorrow is so going to be a tank top stream. Landline to Hot Labs disconnected. Stage 3 alert issued locally. Contaminants in tram tunnels. Station shutdown and evacuation initiated. Code Omega sent. What sort of contaminants escaped? I'm sorry, Commander. Inquiries related to our research require privileged access. Only executives of Binary Helix have that level of clearance. That's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Logging you out. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. User alert. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger trams are offline. Now exiting to the roof. User alert. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger trams are offline. Just see what's up on the roof. I'm interested. Oh shit! User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. User alert. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger trams are offline. Let's see how much Omni Gel I have. User alert. Main reactor shut down oh. in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. It said landline open. User alert. Land. Connections restored.
Processing new data. User alert. Unable to connect to hot lab facilities. That's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Logging you out. I'm tickled pink. Do you have bits to burn but think cheering is too mundane? We have a wide variety of sound alerts and stream stickers from which you can select to interact with the stream in fun ways. A lot of them. Go ahead and give them a try. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. I'm tickled pink, the moon is yellow, and I'm your fellow tonight. Ba -da 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 -da. Oh shit! Motherfucker! He's just a little guy. Now entering main reactor. User alert. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. That's what I'm doing. Okay. All right, girls. Let's go. Shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Dumbass. Boron. But at least he got to keep his soul. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required.
much HP do you have? Fuck. Tali. I'm wearing an environmental suit, and I'm still freezing. I do not like this place. Too many dark secrets. I'll show you my dark secret. Uh, Pokemon Go for its birthday. Wait, what? Who said hello? Wait. Oh, he said hello. As far as I think for a Pokemon card game is for its birthday. Oh, I get what you're saying. Online. Connected to subsidiary facilities. How may I assist you? That's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Logging you out. And then I think now it's just one of the spider things said hello for Yeah yeah yeah. No, I remembered when you said that. I even I even remarked on it. I knew another one was gonna fucking show up. So for some reason, was up after 2 a.m. Oh geez, last night was awful trying to sleep. I hate those nights. Now entering decontamination and transit hub. User alert. Loose contaminants in the decontamination chamber. Access to passenger tramways inadvisable. No. When are there not loose contaminants? Who throws a shoe, honestly? He could have just waited. I would have killed him. Online. Connected to subsidiary facilities. How may I assist you? Tell me what happened here. I'm sorry, but I need a more specific query. Give me a status report on the hot labs. I am sorry. The network connections to the labs have been damaged. Data is limited. What's the status of Rick Station? Rift Station has been locked down by the staff. There are presently no contaminants within the facility. That's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Logging you out. They're coming up through the fucking air vents.
We've got over 200,000 fucking credits right now. We'll be able to get some good equipment tomorrow when we start back up. Oh shit, right? I'm thirsty. Refreshing. Thank you. Water and water and water, water, water and water and water, water, water and water and water, water, water and water and water and water, water and water and water, water and water. How are you doing, Ariel? What was for dinner tonight? I was trying to ask you earlier, but you weren't, you weren't, uh, you were lurking. Excuse me. Now arriving at Rift Station, Binary Helix Research Facility. Yeah, it's the battle music from Final Fantasy VIII. And it's that that's that's been a meme for a while. Hello. Kino, what are you doing? That's your oh shit door. Yeah. Couldn't be sure what was on the tram. Can those things work at trains controls? Hell if I know. I'm not assuming any goddamn thing. Look, you're human and that's enough that I won't shoot. I'd like to know who you are. My name is Shepard. I'm a specter. Huh. I won't look a heavily on course in the mouth. The aliens overran the hot labs last week. Only Han Olar got out and he ain't all there anymore. First, we knew the bastards were clawing into my command post. We had a lot more staff then. You were taken by surprise and had civilians to protect. You did a good job, Captain. Yeah? Sure as hell doesn't feel like it. The board sent an Asari to clean up the mess. She went to the hot labs yesterday. We haven't heard from her since. Venezia, is she still over there? I don't know. I don't see what one person can do. A matriarch has the skill to keep herself alive for a long time. There's an emergency elevator out by the trams. This card will let you activate it. It can take you down to the hot labs. Oh, if you need any first aid, Dr. Cohen's downstairs in the med bay. Tell me about Rift Station. I can't talk about everything. What do you need to know? Tell me about the defenses here. Secure enough that you shouldn't poke in corners. I was just impressed with your operation. Being able to weather a week of assaults is no mean feat. Only the best get assigned to high security facilities like this. What impresses me most is the turrets, alarms, and cameras. They're all routed through a central location out by the quarantine labs. One guy can lock down the whole facility. The security hub's the last logical fallback, and we'd have cover from the turrets all the way. What kind of research is done here? Beats me. I'm not supposed to know. So long as people don't start dying, it's not my problem. I've got work to do. Yeah, I hear that. Hell, man the perimeter.
Thanks for the help. Every few hours, a group comes up the tram tunnel. It's actually better since we locked down the elevator. I'll do whatever I can. I don't know why they keep throwing themselves against our defenses. Even animals should learn not to stick their noses where it hurts. Oh. Where does this go? Hell yeah. Ooh. Yeah, for the fucking uh, boomstick, I want stabilizer. I like my poison rounds.
Perfect. God damn that return right. Okay, we've got everybody good and equipped now. Where did they come from? Where did they go? Did the lab? I never went in the high security areas. Where did they come from, Cotton Eye Joe? Exactly. Quarantine and barracks. What? Sorry, I'll leave. Then I will return to my meditations. What? You seem less upset at this situation than the others. That is one of the virtues of the meditation you interrupted. Fine, fucking bitch. Now. I won't talk to you. Then I will Jesus. My I'm here saving y'all asses. <laughs> what, what? What do you want? Were they attacked by the aliens? They're suffering from a toxin. There was an accident. I have a non-disclosure agreement. I shouldn't discuss it with anyone outside of the company. Fine, let them die. I can help. But you're going to, because I might be able to help. I'd like to think that the company finds our lives more valuable than their secrets. You know Mira, the VI for Peak 15? She handles the safety protocols for our experiments here. I fixed her. We reactivated her on our way through Central Station. That was you? I'm grateful. Until she came online, the automatic equipment wouldn't work. We lost the connection to Mira in the middle of an experiment and the quarantine failed. These three were exposed to a toxin, something we were working on. I understand your caution, but I need details. What you say won't go beyond these walls. It's a bioweapon, based on an exotic life form discovered on the frontier. They wanted something that could kill the creature. But there was no profit in something that kills one species on the frontier. We kept working on it and adapted it to affect more species. Forest B is highly infectious, but it can't pass from one person to another, like a bio-war attack without a pandemic spread. Do you imagine that distinction makes this ethical? Militaries, governments, they'll get this kind of weapon one way or another, and we're trying to limit the damage. I know you can't see that. Is there a cure, Doctor? A treatment? Our first priority was getting it working. We were close to synthesizing an antidote, and Mira went down. It went down! Our notes and equipment are locked in the quarantine labs. Captain Ventrolis doesn't want to risk more contamination. I'll talk to him. Maybe I can convince him to let me try. I can't ask you to do this officially, but if you can do anything, I'd appreciate it. Talk to you later. I hope you can do something. Riz. Always. I might see what all kind of side quests they're wanna, gonna wanna give us here. And maybe just continue this tomorrow. Cause this is a lot more of a snack than I thought it was gonna be. What? No! Although maybe we can just resolve that right now. Sorry, I haven't had much sleep since the attack. Yeah. Is there something you need? I'll talk to you later. Remember to report any suspicious noises. I'll give you a suspicious noise in a second.
Something you need? I've heard about the problems in the quarantine lab. I'd like to recover the toxin cure. God, I wish we could help those guys. I really do, but we can't risk contamination now. We're not part of your defense plan. We're consuming extra rations, extra metagel. Yeah, but you also have extra guns. All right, you want to gamble with your life, you're not under my command. I'll have the guard let you in, but he'll lock the door behind you. He'll run a full scan before I'll let you out. If there are any anomalies, you stay in there. It's fair. Those are reasonable precautions. I'll radio ahead to let the guard know. Good luck. I've got work to do. You and me both. I like Ventralis. Fine, let's go down there and do the shit. Let's get her done. Let's go save those six scientists. It is warm. Good God, the thing says it's 91 in this room right now. You came to find out about them, didn't you? You mean those things out there? Yeah, yes. Nikki. I'm the only survivor from the hot lab, you know. I need to know more about those things out there. About the Rachni? Rachni? That's preposterous. Where did they come from? They found it in a derelict ship. An egg. Been waiting since the last battles. They brought it here. Shut up! God, you want to get us killed? I don't have any control over who lives or dies here. Do you? If you're going to be crazy, be the quiet kind. Crazy? I'm sane. God, am I sane. I need to know everything about the Ragnar. I told you all I can. We brought the Ragnar back from the dead. In retrospect, a bad decision. You think? My drugs alarm just went. I'll off. be leaving now. Yeah. Okay, this one will get. Oh. You're not part of the crew. Call me Shepard. I'm a Spectre, sent by the Citadel. There aren't any human Spectres. Look, Blake doesn't care who you are. This lab is under quarantine. What do you want? I have Ventralis' permission to go in there. Yeah, he radioed. He also said you have to prove you're not contaminated to get out. You got a death wish? You should stand watches on the barricade.
I've isolated four chemicals that can be combined to counteract the toxin. They must be mixed in precise quantities as each chemical is poured. The equipment will mark the minimum and maximum amount that will work. Too little or too much will spoil the result. I get it. Your mission ends here, Shepard. I thought she seemed odd. You're a sleeper agent for Venezia. I was ordered to eliminate you should the opportunity arise. And here you are, trapped in this lab. No, you're Nothing trapped free. in this lab. Did I tell you that I have a Jedi on my team? Fuck! Liara's terrifying. Liara ended that faster than it started. Son of a bitch. At least I made the cure before the place got trashed. She killed the guard, Shepard. Just for being in her They came out of there. You mean the get the inorganics the Asari had with her. Venezia brought them with her. How can I get into the maintenance area? Team lead would have access, like Dr. Cohen. He's in the medical bay. I'll be leaving now. Yeah. So, wait, what does my main quest want me to do? Okay, so, like, my final thing is to go to the hot labs. Because that's where Benezia is. So, hot labs is my final objective. Watch Jill. Jill's cool. I like Jill. Jill's neat. Is that the cure? You did it? That Asari scientist? The one in the mess hall, she just tried to kill us. Alessia? That's unbelievable. I, I, uh, I don't know much about her. She arrived a month ago. One of the shareholders pulled strings to get her here. Let me guess. Saren, the Spectre? Yes. I think that was the name. I, I don't pay attention to the other research teams. Look. The guards? 
They've been more on edge since you got here. I think they were expecting you. There are more labs in the back. The guards won't even let me back there. Just people with clearance. Thanks for the warning. Here's the cure. Let me see that file. An extension on Phelps' work? I thought he was on the right track. I can't thank you enough that... Oh, God, what a cliché. You saved their lives, do you know that? Could you spare a few medical packs? They're worth their weight in gold up here. You didn't get these from me. And Trollis wanted them saved for his people. I need to administer this. Thanks again. They seem to be coming along well. I need to get into the maintenance area. You're not supposed to go back there. But I guess there's nothing to hurt. Here's my pass. Just don't tell the guards. Talk to you later. Of course. Be careful. Fuck it. We'll just finish this up. It's... 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 Fuck it. We've all... Oh, this was that storage. My funny little run. My funny little run. I don't know why I'm leaning over like that's going to help me see around the corner. You ever do that? It's like, it's like, wait a minute, the screen is flat. Turn it toward happiness or despair. Her children were to be ours, raised to hunt and slay Saren's enemies. It's the blue booba lady. I won't be moved by sympathy, no matter who you bring into this confrontation. Liara's here because she wants to be, not because I asked her to. Indeed. What, what have you told him about me, Liara? What could I say, Mother? That you're insane? Evil? Should I explain how to kill you? What could I say? Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. I can't believe you'd kill your own daughter. I now realize I should have been stricter with her. You know, I just killed a bunch of Asari commandos because they tried to kill me.
Oh, so now it's Geth. I ate Geth for breakfast. Liara is a fucking monster. Excuse me, sir? Sir. Sir. Poison bullets. She's running herself low on energy. light. Everything is clear. The Rachni didn't cooperate with you. Why should I? I will not betray him. You will. You... You must listen. Saren still whispers in my mind. I can fight his compulsions briefly, but the indoctrination is strong. Why are you able to break free of his control now? I sealed a part of my mind away from the indoctrination, saving it for a moment when I could help destroy him. It will not last long. Are you saying he brainwashed you? People are not themselves around Sam. You come to idolize him, worship Ashes. him. You would do anything for him. The key is Sovereign, his flagship. It is a dreadnought of incredible size, and its power is extraordinary. Again, this is a really, uh, this, it's, it's, <gasps> a Niv's back! Um, this is, this is one of those times where it's a really good thing that I don't have one of those eye trackers. Sovereign's not like other ships. Where did it come from? I cannot say. The Geth did not build it. Its technology is far more advanced than that of any known species. I'm reading the, the you stay aboard, captions. The more Saren's will seems correct. You sit at his feet and smile. That's why my eyes are down there. I'm reading the into. captions. It is They're so low. I thought I was strong enough to resist. Instead, I became a willing tool, eager to serve. He sent me here to find the location of the Mew Relay. Its position was lost thousands of years ago. How does something that big go missing? Four thousand years ago, a star nearby went supernova. The shockwave propelled the relay out of its system, but did not damage it. Its precise vector and speed are impossible to determine. As millennia passed, the nebula created by the nova enveloped the relay. It is difficult to find any cold object in interstellar space particularly something swathed in hot dust and radiation. Someone on Noveria found it? Two thousand years ago, 
the Rachni inhabited that region of our galaxy, they discovered the relay. The Rachni can share memories across generations. Queens inherit the knowledge of their mothers. I took the location of the relay from the Queen's mind. I was not gentle. You can still make it right. Give me the information. I was not myself, but I should have been stronger. I transcribed the data to an OSD. Take it, please. Knowing the relay's coordinates is not enough. Do you know where he planned to go from there? Saren wouldn't tell me his destination. But you must find out quickly. I transmitted the coordinates to him before you arrived. You have to stop me. I, I can't. His teeth are at my ear. Fingers on my spine. You sh you should. Oh, you should. Mother, I don't leave. Fight him. You've always made me proud, Liara. Die. Oh, no. She fucking dropped me. I cannot go on. You will have to stop him, Shepard. Hold on. We've got Medigel. Maybe we can... No. He is still in my mind. I am not entirely myself. I never will be again. Mother. Good night, little wing. I will see you again with the dawn. No light. They always said there would be a... <sighs> She died a lot faster than I expected her to. Like, plot-wise. I thought she was gonna be like... A big bad for a while. Size sack of potatoes. One of the commandos is up. She's like a zombo. This one serves as our voice. Oh. We cannot sing. Not in these low spaces. Your musics are colorless. Musics? What? Your way of communicating is strange. Flat. It does not color the air. When we speak, one moves all. We are the mother. 
We sing for those left behind. The children you thought silenced. We are Rachni. Did you order your people to kill the science team? No. We were locked away here. The children are beyond our songs. They have been lost to silence. The children we birthed were stolen from us before they could learn to sing. They are lost to silence. End their suffering. They cannot be saved. They will only cause harm as they are. I don't understand. Why are your children killing people? These needlemen, they stole our eggs from us. They sought to turn our children into beasts of war, claws with no songs of their own. Our elders are comfortable with silence. Children know only fear if no one sings to them. Fear has shattered their minds. I understand. A child left alone in a closet until she is 16 would not be sane. All right. I don't think they'll give me much choice anyway. Before you deal with our children, we stand before you. What will you say? Will you release us? Are we to fade away once more? Look. Those tanks? Acid. Strong enough to kill anything, no matter its biology. They wouldn't have installed that if they weren't afraid of the consequences of her getting loose. They made a mistake. They let the Krogan go too far. This is a chance for us to atone. She has done nothing to us. Your companions hear the truth. You have the power to free us. Or return our people to the silence of memory. I won't destroy your entire race. You'll go free. You will give us the chance to compose anew? We will remember. We will sing of your forgiveness to our children. Because she's a victim here. Like, it would have been fucked up to kill her. She now knows advanced lift. And she now knows advanced dampening. Okay, we'll go deal with the hot labs and then get back to the Normandy and call it a night, and then tomorrow we'll start off with that next uh, main quest. We just have to kill the Rachna down in the hot labs.
I'm not allowed to go back down that way anymore. Do you even lift? Fucking Liara does. Hello, sir? Are you here to secure the situation? That's right. I'm a Council Spectre. Who are you? I am Yaroslav Tartakovsky, the Operations Director. I would stand and shake hand, but... Uh, you must listen to me. If we do not contain our mistake, they will drop bombs from the battle stations. You understand? You let these things out? Uh, I am only following the orders. The binary hill which found an egg. It was on a derelict ship, thousands of years drifting. This was Rachna's ship. Inside they find many eggs in cryogenic suspension. A thousand year old egg hatched? Yes. Very tough to be so long frozen. That it survived the centuries. This is miraculous. Binary Helix plan to clone Ragnai. We must produce them, create an army. But when they get here, they find this egg is not a common Ragnai. It is a queen. After she lays eggs, they move her to reach the station. They are thinking that without her, they can raise the babies to be obedient. Obviously, they were wrong. Ah, this was exactly the wrong thing to do. I am thinking that without a queen, Rachni do not develop properly. That is correct. Her mind is shaping theirs. That is correct. These Rachni are uncontrolled. Then all we need to do is bring her here. No, I am sorry. But Where did let her go? Not work. These Rachni are beyond saving. It is a sad thing, but they must be euthanized. I am thinking that the neutron perch must be set off. How do we set off the purge? Armin controls are nearby. All you do is insert the key. Then I will give Mira destruction. Oh shit! I have full access to the facility and am at your disposal. Activate the neutron purge. I'm sorry, but I can't do that without proper code authorization. Code input 875-020-079. Code Omega, local execution. Verify. Code Omega execution in 120 seconds. Got a blast! Oh, 
All right. We're, we, we're done. We did it. And there is no more going back down to either of those places. It is done. They are finished with me. Oh, I guess I could go back through maintenance if I really wanted to. If I really wanted to. But there's no need. I did everything that there was to do there. Like, that thing that I thought was a side quest was just to help me get through the main quest. Like, there weren't any side quests in there. Which is nice to know that they're not going to give me, like, random bullshit side quests during shit like this. Oh, fuck. What's our next move, Commander? Head for the Mew Relay? The Mew Relay could link to dozens of systems. Unless we know exactly where Saren's going, we'd just be wasting our time. The Commander is right. We cannot rush off blind. We still need to learn more about Saren. Who put you in charge? Did the Commander resign when I wasn't looking? Calm down. We're all on the same team here, Williams. She's just trying to help. Sorry, Commander. It's okay. This is a tough mission. We're all on it. Everyone go get some rest. Crew, dismissed. Bavaria report is away, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? Yes. Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. Is this report accurate, Commander? You found Rachni on Navarra. And then release the Queen. Do you have any idea what you've done? How many generations until they overrun the galaxy? They won't. This Queen is different. She understands why her kind had to be wiped out last time around. I hope you're right, Shepard. My children's children will pay the price if you're not. We'll be waiting so for two generations is better. what you think. I did not skip it. It just skipped. Oh yeah, that's right. Tomorrow we have this side quest to start with and then we'll do this. And we'll talk to all of our crew members tomorrow before we let out. We'll, we'll start up tomorrow having a nice conversation with everybody. God, a lot got done today. Exit. Who do I feel like raiding? With, like, the few of us that are left. Well, we just raided Amy last night. We could raid Eris again. I kind of want to give Eris plenty of love now that she's back. We'll probably do. We'll probably do do. Uh, we'll probably for for the time being, whenever we notice Eris is online, giving her a raid Where a bit more are frequently. These people? I haven't seen a now that she's okay. back into the, oh the streaming swing of things. Angle sounded like popcorn. Oh Jesus. Don't come over here. Well, here. yeah, nobody. Hopefully, you can get here. some rest. What weapons do I have? God, that was a Fucking long stream. Nothing. Um, great. But we'll go raid Eris. We'll have a nice time over there hanging out with her. Um, I see nobody. That's right. Me neither. He sees nobody too. And then tomorrow we'll do more Mass Effect. And I've been then, doing that and then poop. I'll have adult like, beverages and we'll go back I and check all of the fucking planets we need to double back to. That's gonna be fucking fun. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, see you tomorrow. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Stay safe out there. Uh, keep it nerdy and bye.
potatoes. <laughs>